Uh, anyway, uh, last night we saw. <laughs> you don't know what this movie is, then. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it has a nuclear uh, cat in it. That's all I'm gonna say. We saw that and and Tetsuyo the Iron Man. Watch a lot of Japanese horror last night, which was a real treat. It was really treat, uh, a real treat. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna go be right back, and this cat cracks me up the fuck up. But uh, yeah, guys, uh, sit tight and Game Dev Tycoon coming right up. So, uh, <laughs> you know, I I I I don't care. I don't care. I know you can't stream movies on Twitch, but I, I gotta show you this real quick. Well, I can show a segment out of this movie, so you know what we're talking about. Uh, we can fucking find this movie. There we go. How's <laughs> the, the fucking movie seems spelled this way. How's <laughs> How's this great fucking movie? I've talked about this movie before, but this is the first time I streamed it. But uh, yeah, How's <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, this movie just starts off as a crazy crackhead movie, like, hang on. Oh, here we go, here we go, here's the intro, it's, it's fantastic. You ready for this? A movie! What kind of movie? What movie is it? Anyway, this... This movie gets... Crazy. Isn't it great? <laughs> you know, that, that's kind of the movies I'm into. Uh, <clears throat> you should watch this movie if you're if you're in the mood for like something crazy for October now. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> anyway, uh, I'll be right back. I'm gonna set up and we're gonna play some Game Dev Tycoon. So don't go anywhere. Get out of here, house of cat. What was his name again? Blonchi, uh, Blonchi. I forgot what this cat was, but uh, holy shit! <laughs> yeah, if, if you if you missed it yesterday, we we streamed. Uh, I shouldn't be screaming when I'm this sick. But uh, yeah, uh, I'm gonna play some the game. Game. I can't ever pronounce this. Gay, gay dev tycoon. Ooh, now we're talking business. You know. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I'm gonna play some games. I'm not gonna do Earthbound tonight, because, you know, I don't really want to voice act, but my voice is kinda thrashed and, and sick. So, I'm just gonna take it easy, uh, and, uh, play some games that don't require me to, like, uh, talk too much. Hang on. Aspect Ratio Simulator, ready for this? Hang on. Got it. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Kusogi games. Did it take long for that thing to like roll out and die? What? Well, that's the stamp of quality, baby. Hey, uh, hey, fuck you. What the hell? <laughs> God damn it. And this cat is not helping at all. There's a scene in House where the cat just spews blood. I, I'm not even kidding about it. It's fantastic. I don't know. House vomit blood. Like the whole movie just fakes you out completely. Like you, you think you're watching something like just fun. It's a bunch of schoolgirls just prancing around and it's got a, like a happy theme. And then suddenly this happens. It's just good, good gravy. Good gravy. Yes. Yes, indeed, but true. It's truth to be told, I, I love how so. It, it has the worst ending ever, which works in its favor, though, because, um, you know, it's just a what the fuck movie, and the ending is just what the fuck. Like, I'd say the ending makes it, like, it's kind of boring to sit through at the store. You're like, oh my god, what is this? It's so stupid. But at the end, you're like, oh, this is what it all built up to, huh? <sighs> Jesus Christ. <sighs> game, ge game dev tycoon. Ugh. Right. Now we can do this properly. I hope. There we go. What, what a weird intro to a stream, but uh, that's what happens sometimes, man. And aspect ratio. What's that? 
Hang on. That's the best we'll get, I think. I I hate I hate a game that game game tank tank doesn't do this properly for me. Like I don't want to sit around and make my own 69. Fuck you. <laughs> all these streams look different because all the all the aspect ratios are are different. Just stay, dude. Stay. All right. Fuck. All right. That's the best we'll get. What a bunch of shit. What a bunch of shit. All right, so uh, yes, Game Dev Tycoon, uh, the continued adventures of uh, Kusogi Games, and it's a fucking miracle this this company hasn't you know bit the dust yet. I'm I'm really surprised actually, but um, um, yeah, this 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 aspect ratio is pissing me off. Can I correct this somehow? <laughs> Hang on. All right, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a sin. I'm gonna do a sin. There, I committed a sin. Look at that. It's slightly stretched out. I hope it doesn't bother anyone. Anyway, uh, <clears throat> the big convention will take place. No, fuck all that. I don't need that. Um, yeah. So if you don't know, I'm a little sick today. That's why I'm kind of off. But uh, yeah. Anyway, uh, let's look at our game history from last time. Let's see here, game history. We released, maybe possibly our last game, which was a sequel to, possibly our last game, which was a classic. Everybody loved this one. But the PS2's follow-up kind of sucked ass. Which, uh, you know, not good. Um, I can do that afterwards, bummer, don't worry. Alright. I can send him on a vacation. Not, you know what, go on a vacation. We're not doing anything. We're just kind of swimming in money. Just kind of not doing anything. And Derek. 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 You know what you should do, Derek? You should do... None of that. What you should do, Derek. You should... Um, what should Derek do? Uh, I don't know. Marketing. Yeah, let's do marketing. Dud. Dud. Yeah, marketing would be great. Then we can reach a bigger audience. Or we can, you know, investigate what makes it. The N64 is no longer supported. Question, was the N64 the last console with cartridges? Marketing, yes. What else should we research? Open world. You know what would be fantastic? If we could... I don't know if this game does that, but if you can make MMORPGs. I mean, yeah, you could actually. Multiplayer. An open world? Wait, you can't do open world? Oh, we do. We gotta get that. We gotta get that right now, dude. It is? It was? Yeah, no. Unless we count the Game Boy Advance. Well, you know, the Nintendo 3DS. Well, I'm thinking like consoles. I'm not thinking handhelds. I don't really count handhelds as consoles. And I just, I just, I'm getting a phone call from my dad, actually. I swear to God. Hang on.
Oh, God damn it. Jesus Christ. Uh, anyway, uh, yeah, sorry about that. Sorry about that intermission. Uh, that, that's what happens sometimes. It just kind of happens. Uh... Whoever's spamming Y in my chat, uh, get out of here. You know how I feel about F spam. Y spam. If, if, if you're subscribed to my channel, then uh, you doing that is just kind of, wow. Fucking no. <clears throat> Alright. Have it your way, buddy. Anyway, uh, yes, I'm back. Sorry about that. Uh, anyway, let's see here. Today, the inventor has announced a new mobile console called the. N the hey, I was just talking about the DS. Holy fuck. Uh, the Nintendo G Ninvento GS. It features two screens, one of them touch sensitive. Wait a minute, is that misspelled? No. No, 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 it's not. Is it sensitive? I, I gotta hang on. Okay, no, it's not. I, I, I I've always spelt spelt it sensitive. I guess it's just my own damn stupid illiteracy, but um, uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, and promise unique gameplay. While the inventor has been struggling to gain their market lead ever since the Nintendo 64, they still have a very strong position on the mobile market. Invento GS promised to strengthen this position and aims to breathe life into a stagnating mobile market. The console will be in stores next month. Alright. Green 3DS. I'd have that one. Vani announced they're releasing a new mode called the Portable Play System or PPS. Uh, not, not PCP Station, which is a real thing, by the way. It's a bootleg PSP. It's called PCP Station. Hang on. Uh, it, it's funny as fuck. Hang on. Yeah, sort of god, PCP station. If you watch Ashton's, you should probably be familiar with this, but, uh... Yeah, PCP station. I love fucking, you know, drinking PCP, but, you know... Oh boy. <clears throat> anyway, Bombet, bar brother. Uh, media analyst, analysts speculate that this announcement is meant to distract you from the Nintendo's launch of the Nintendo G via... Uh, uh, um, well, I sure do hope that when it releases, people hack it quickly, because all the other se sequential uh, re-releases of the PSP will be unhackable. For example, I bought a PSP under the false premise that I could hack it and put emulators on it. Little did I know that um, the PSP I bought was the 4000 model, or the latest one, and you can't hack that one, so, you know. Trash! While an Inventor GS utilizes an innovative dual screen, the PCP, P, PCP station, you, instead of using a single screen, we'll focus on the game, whatever, whatever. I didn't enjoy the, 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 the PSPs too much. I gotta be honest. I... It was okay, but... The games I had for it wasn't that fun. Like, I had Castlevania, the Round of Blood 3D remake, which was fucking terrible. Um, and I also had the, um, the, the GTA Liberty City stories or whatever, kind of, kind of just mediocre, wasn't too f big on it, but, um, I will tell you one thing that I really remember fondly about the PCP station, <laughs> uh, is the, um, uh, the sound, the sound was the worst, it sounded so trebly with no bass, like it sounded like you were on a fucking, like, 50s phone, you know, the one where you spin up, like, it was the worst sound ever, like, you, you had to have headphones for it, but, uh, yeah, anyway. <clears throat> Can you emulate PCP now? I, I, I'm all kind of stuff saying the PSP, PCP is so much more for it to say. Uh, yeah, we're not doing anything. We're just kind of just chilling out, which is terrible. You should do always do something in this. Um, mono sound, which makes no sense because I have stereo, so I can research outdated technology. Which, all right, you know, I really want the multi joiner. That'd be fucking great. PSP, the PCP. Yeah, we should we should start working on a game, dude. We should start working on a game. Yeah, let's let's make a game, dude. Uh, we're gonna develop. Hang on, let's see if we can find a publishing deal. Uh, 
Any top at action. Low wood productions. Uh, RPG. Let's see, they want a seven. You know what? By Capcom. Capcom essentially wants me to do this. Upfront pay. You know what? You know what? I can probably deliver something out of a seven for Capcom. You know what? I'll fucking do it. Um, this will be a... A... I'm really good at dungeon RPGs, goddammit. And, uh... Maybe... How would it fare on, on the DS? That'd be kind of good. DS RPG, right? That wouldn't be terrible. What, how the fuck is the Game Boy still around? Sh wait, wait, well, hang on. The, the original Game Boy? Not like Game Boy Color or, like, you know, Advance. The, the original Game Boy is still around. While well, the DS is, like, oh, okay. Not taking off the market, I, I suppose. All right, let's let's get one for GS. Do you want to pay for acquire a license? Shit, we gotta have a license for it. So we could take a risk. All right, so we've done a lot of dungeon RPGs on the PC, which again is great, but I've done a lot of them. But what I could do instead is I could get the GS, which is newer and sort of a shot in the dark, but I could probably sell more on it. So what do you say? Play it safe on PC or do GS? Because if you do too much of the same stuff on PC, people get bored. So GS maybe would... I don't know. What do you think? Yeah, the Game Boy Micro, dude. Yeah. GS. You think so? Okay, we're gonna go with GS. It's worth the risk. It's not that much money anyway, but... Uh, Run Song Cole. That's right. And everyone, yeah. Can I do medium? Yeah. All right. This is gonna be called. Uh, it's gonna be called port portable, p portable, uh, portable, uh, uh, p p p p power, uh, power p pigs, which is a real thing. Power pigs from outer space or whatever. Terrible fucking SNES game. Portable, uh, dungeon party, which sounds like that one guy from Austria, but, uh, don't want to touch that. Uh-uh. is it's me! Actually, I shouldn't be voice acting because I'm sick, but, um. How about this? Portable party. <laughs> the game. Now you can shit in a portable party while on the go. It's meta, and it's great. <laughs> How about this? How about this? How about this? Potato... Uh... I don't know. How about something with D? Because it's dungeon. How about this? Dungeon... Uh... Dungeon... Uh... Dongs. <laughs> Portable... Uh... Penis. No. Phantom Pain Us US Version You know, the NTSC version, baby That's right <laughs> That's right <laughs> Here we go Um I don't really see the point in having 3D graphics on the DS when it's just, like, sprites are better It- it just is so I'm just gonna go with that. We should do some research, maybe. Marketing. Let's do some marketing. Let's... Let's fucking, uh... Large campaign. I don't even have that money. Holy fuck. I'm gonna put it in the magazine, dude. Alright, now we have Derek as well. Derek! Um, story and quests. So of course, you know, damn son, you'll do that. Um... What else? Ending is not that important. Gameplay... I've done this before. I think this is okay. You know, we got story quests, which is always the most valuable thing in a game like this. The engine, not so much, essentially, because, you know, it's an RPG. It doesn't really matter that much. It's, you know, walk left, right, up, down. So, uh... Yeah. Less engine. No, no, you don't want to have too little. You don't want to have too little. I want to kind of put it up here. Derek! I'm gonna go with this. You guys say we should go with this? Yes? 
I'm asking you guys, you're my employees, dude. I can't just be, you know, green lighting ship without your permission. Not that I, you know, and it's nothing to do with the fact that, you know, if you guys say yes and the game fails, it's not, no, of course not, it's me blaming you guys, right? No. No. I feel like the sickness is just being spread around the streamers, yeah. Abel Huga. I know, right? Vinny had it first. Uh, Vinny said, uh, Vinny made a really funny comment on Twitter about it. It's like, it's the Wolbach, yeah. Lower on the engine, alright, a little bit more, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, we can, we can go with that. Get the hype. Hi, <clears throat> uh, this is Tom Mott from Center. I got word of Kasuka Games is working on a new game. Would you like to be able to... Yes, I, I'll, we'll do an interview. What is your expectations regarding the success of Dungeon Dogs, Phantom Pain is... I mean, I mean, I'm sorry, Phantom Pain, US. Do you think the game will be re well received? It's me, Snake, Master Miller. I, w I wish you sounded like that in in in, uh, in MDS5. You're going to extract him. <laughs> He's coming with us. It's me, Snake. Master Moon. Yes, hype game. Thank you for your time. I'm oh, sorry, I do more voice acting unintentionally. Alright, uh, artificial intelligence doesn't really matter. Damn, son! Um, we can let Derek do some stuff. This is good, actually. This is good. Can I do dual? You, can you, like, split? Can you split the, uh, the amount of work? Well, Derek! Damn, son, you're not gonna do two things. There we go. That, that's that's the best thing, yeah. Yeah, yeah, for sure, dude. 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 That's gonna be a good one. A doozy. Derek! A little bit more, I guess. Doesn't really matter. It's actually bad. Yeah, let's just keep it at that. We got a lot of hype for this, which is great. Look at this. This better not fuck up. You know what would make this game really fucking interesting? And it, this sounds ridiculous, but I honestly would like this. I would honestly like if... If we could, uh... It could do that. Yeah, that's a good balance, actually. But you know what? I would honestly like if you could get some really stupid shit in. Like, you could honestly pay reviewers. Like... Even though that sounds really scummy, it would really add a, a level of gameplay that is more like moral stuff, like... Do you wish to pay reviewers? But also mistrust from customers, you know what I mean? I, I, I honestly like that, I would like that, if you could pay reviewers and be a scumass, you know... I'd actually like that. I would do it, of course, but, uh, you know... I can play as EA then, yeah, of course. A little bit more sound. There you go. This one is gonna be good. Trust me. It's... Dude, look at the hype on this monster of a game. Alright. In two months, the Dream Vast will be taken off the market. Yeah, alright. Let's get those bugs. I've got a lot of fucking bugs on this. Alright. And one more. Yeah, alright. Good. Dungeon Dongs, Phantom Pain, U.S. <laughs> People like you, Toby Fox, of doing that. Yeah, yeah, I I'm sure Toby, the small indie developer, goes around just, you know, making it rain on the game develop uh, game reviewers. You know, he paid me. All right, I, I, you know, I, I'll say that up front right now. Toby Fox, he, uh, I hated Undertale. You know, I hated Undertale. Uh, one of the worst games ever made, uh, Toby Fox gave me three chicken nuggets to say good things about his game. He paid me five milkshakes. <laughs> Alright, let's release this. Easter eggs! Oh man, that makes a game. Wait, Easter eggs? Is that a research? Just put in like a little penis in, 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 in one of the sprites, dude. Scandalous. 
Alright guys, I can't look. Here we go. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Sit tight. Uh... Un, du, toi. Is it good? Is it good? Rolling! Rolling in the gold! Yeah! Oh god, my voice, I shouldn't, I'm sick! Oh yeah! Yeah, boy! Ooh! Ooh! Yeah, look at that shit! Holy fuck! They love it. Damn, it's great! Here comes the money, we even marketed that shit, oh my god. I'm sure Capcom is happy with me now, god damn. Oh, money. 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 Metro Quiet, we are looking forward to business. Yeah, no shit. Ten million dollars! And it's still going to be a while. Damn, so for, I made a very bold remarks about the you were successful. Now, the game is on the market. The guns is, it was spot on as the game has received very positive reviews. Oh, ten million dollars. Self-published meeting games. Oh, my God. Oh my god, look at all that money! Uh, let's see here. The boss Casol Games has grown well under your management. I think it's time to move the company out of this technology park and into a building worthy of success. I've seen the perfect building for headquarters. It's not cheap, but allowed to go even further. Shit, you got 16 million! Holy fuck! Uh, what do you guys say? We got. I mean, that's half of our money, yeah, but we could allow even more people to work on it. Yeah, you guys see this? Should we move out and just expand? Jesus, fuck yeah, one mail into 16. Alright, let's do it. God damn. Oh, look at this, look at this shenanigans. Uh, well, we have widescreen technology now. <laughs> Ooh. Wait, hang on, wait, what? Wait, actual games? Like, bit... Bit Trip Runner and uh, Meat Boy and uh, th th this indie thing for P uh, PS3, whatever, and the Cave Story. Not too familiar with this one though, but uh, regardless, uh, huh, kind of odd that they actually had. I guess it's because it's indie games and this is an indie game as well, but regardless. Welcome to the new headquarters of Kasuga Games. We now have more space so you can increase the team further. The new office is also close to some renowned university, which also great access to new talent. All right. I kind of don't like this 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 new style. I don't like. I like the cubicles. Damn it! Hello, Kasogi Games. We have just learned that you opening your new headquarters not far away from our university. We are new to the special for you if you use your help. Fortunately, we cannot offer any pay, but I think you will find teaching students about the game developing but a great exercise to find your own company. Yeah, that's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. I'm gonna hire a new guy. Has caused a storm of good reviews and excited customers. Industry professionals say Dungeon Dongs. One of those rare games that will set a new quality standards of future games. Yeah, that's right. It seems like it really has made it easier with it. Yeah, I, I know. I know, right? Alright, I'm gonna dump a lot of money for a good guy here. Like, yeah. Should be some complex algorithms, dude. Wow, this new office is amazing and the location is perfect too. I took a walk around the building earlier and had this radical idea. Why don't we open up our own research and development department? Alright, this could really speed up our uh, research and would allow to, uh, us to attack bigger projects. Wait, attack bigger? Okay, yeah. It would be cheap, but I think it will allow us to lead your innovator. Oh, yeah, alright. Anyway, I have done some research, and I think we should open a lab and hire a whole team of researchers. But we can do this, however. We should have at least one design specialist in our team, alright? You know the design specialist open a research and development lab. You can train someone to become a researcher. Alright, I, I guess that could be the new guy. You can also train technology specialists to come in handy for later options, okay? We need more- we need to embezzle more GMP, dude. So we got Sipmeyer. <laughs> I get it. Gabriel Heinz, uh, Emmanuel Wade, and Hasir Nibili. So, uh, they're all pretty good. Dude, Sipmeyer. Sip Mayer is fucking amazing. Look at this speed and research. His speed is incredible. Look at the technology. Holy fuck. Should 
Should we get him? He's not- he- Emmanuel is the most expensive guy, but actually... Uh, he's got even more technology, but he's not as fast. I think we gotta go with Sep. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I think Sep is good. Alright, let's go. Large games? Oh, yeah. Two months, the game link will be taken off the market. Yeah, no shit, it's been around since, like... Fucking 89. Jesus. Oh, well, I have some pictures of a new office cutting it. Well, I I have seen some pictures of your new office cutting edge stuff. I'm sure you're doing it very well, but I think you need to help me brought it in a couple of years to be taken over Jason. Large contract been locked. Yeah, right. You know what? Let's do let's do let's blow some money on a large booth. Uh Yeah. I have money. I can do it. I can do it, dude. Strong audience, they want mature games. Alright. I think. We should generate a game report on this. Really fucking good. And we should also research some stuff. We should research... Uh... Shit, I can't do... Multi-genre shit yet. No, no multi-genre shit yet, but, uh... What I could do... Is I could do a new topic, maybe. No, I don't want to do that. But I do want to do larger games. Large games, yeah. It's gonna be a big one. Big. Big and strong. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Hi, boss. I have a knack for security. I think we could do really security upgrades. What the fuck? I've done some research. I think we an investment of, will be safer than we are not. All right, just all right. Get some get some shotguns out there. Just you know, put put some uh, put some uh, you know saw blades in the fucking hallway. So when they try to like get my moolah, they'll get a you know. A handful of blood, fucker. You can't steal my games. It's been released. Oh, the PSP. Oh man, look look at all them police. Oh man, that's a lot of people. Mm, well, it's not like a ton of people, but but still, still. Well, play seventy two. All right, that that's okay. <laughs> that's that's tight. This fucking thing is still selling, dude. Game link is no you supported you released one game for the platform and earned a total of yeah. Uh gameplay seems to be quite important for this type of game. Yeah. Insights. Derek Johnson is still new to the team. A few more games and the team will have higher potential. Alright, De Derek! I'm gonna say it by the way. Vonnie. All right, let's see here. Uh, you can also research. Uh, let's see what what can I do for thirty day and night cycle? <laughs> that, that might be good for our RPG. And uh, Derek, you can do Easter eggs. You got some Easter eggs in, dude. <laughs> oh fuck me! Yeah, this is the Elkasoga Games, though. We've actually managed to drive a company successful. It's kind of insane. 20 million units. Holy fuck. That is not bad. That is not fucking bad. Alright, but we can't rest easy yet. We might have we might have had uh success with that, but we can't get lazy, dude. We can't get fucking lazy, we can't. Sip. Actually, hang on. Uh train. Design specialist, yeah. Game design course. G3 innovation challenge. No, no, no. Yeah. Let's see here. Um, let's make let's make a new one. Let's see if we can find any more publishing deals. Let's see here. A casual game for Nintendo. Who would have thought? Um, mystery action. Any topic RPG. For mature, well, mature audience. Yeah, you know what? Let's make a game for the GameCube, dude. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. All right. What do you guys think? RPG for GameCube with a mature audience, with which is strong at the moment. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Large game as well. A hey, game size. Let's do this. Spherical. Spherical. 
All right, mature, large. This is gonna be called uh, uh, blood, fucker, revenge, of of darkness. <laughs> That's the most mature <laughs> title I can think of. No, 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 no. No, we're gonna go with something better. We're gonna go with uh, uh, black, uh, heart. Darkness, shadow, blood, edge. E. e okay. Uh, blood. It. E e blooded. Uh. What else? No. No. Linking Park, the RPG. Awesome. Awesome, dude. Fantastic. You know, it it's a digging simulator, cause you know, you crawl. Under the skin. Uh. No. Not, fuck this. Blood. Dark. Uh, let's, let's make something that. How about this? How about this? How about this? Uh. Crawling. In. My. Skin. You know, it's a bunch of games. Uh, well, we just released this. Wait a minute, that would be terrible. That would be terrible to think about it. We could do another dungeon one, but... Mm. You know what? Let's make a cyberpunk one. Yeah, because that's mature. You know it. You know it. And it's gonna be a run, run some coal, baby. Alright, here we go. Ugh. Whoa. You know, I might be fucked here, actually. It's because I just released something that was on the DS, that was an RPG. Now I release something on the GameCube, that's an RPG. Well, I get points off for doing something kind of similar. What? Well, it's a... Well, that, that'd be like criticizing fucking Square Enix if, like, you know... You know, I can't make RPG games. Like, it's what they're fucking known for. Like, if they suddenly started making... Well, that's actually not true. Square actually publishes uh, other stuff, like Deus Ex and, and stuff like that. So that's not true. That won't matter. It's fine. All right, fine. I got... I guess we're going to do with 3D... Gra I mean, the 2D graphics look better, but on the GameCube, that's got to look shit. So, uh... Let's do 3D graphics. Which I really should have developed a little bit more. Alright, so gameplay is really important. Uh, engine, again, is not, like, super duper important, but... Uh, I guess for the next engine, that all the stuff we're researching now will come into play, but... Um, Alright. Uh, yeah, for sure. You gotta gameplay a little bit like this. Engine down just a bit. Alright, good. It's gotta be text-based. You know it. All right. You know what we should do as well. Let, let's let's do a fucking massive campaign for two million. Oh my god. Yeah. Let's just. If this turns out shitty, it's just gonna. Uh oh. Oh no. The market. Oh no. We, we, we just started making a mature RPG. Oh, we're fucked now. Oh no. <laughs> Oh my god, since the market is normalized again. Oh my god. We couldn't get the game out before the, the market just... Oh my god. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh, it's sweet, Jesus. Alright. Uh, Derek, you'll do this. Or You know what? Let's, do, let's make Sip do it. Yeah, for sure. I will sign a little bit more and... Get that down a little bit more. Yeah, I did save. Don't worry. This is gonna be the best game ever. Ever. Quick, censor all the the, the, the mature stuff. Uh, you just put black bars and and uh, you know dingle keys in front of the player's face so they don't see all the blood and gore I put in. Oh, Jesus. All right. Uh, let's see here. Damn, son. Oh, that's terrible. 
Let's see who who will have the least amount of work here. I mean, it seems that if Derek does it, it it's gonna not be too bad. All right, let, let's do it like this. 3D graphics version one on Game GameSphere. Yeah, yeah, you know, Genki wasn't too renowned for you know 3D graphics. Hey GPM. All right, now we're gonna fucking do this. I I, I feel it in my bones that it can it can't work. I I swear to God, if it does fuck up though, like, man, th this might be the the fucking the, the missile that hits the the Hindenburg. That's not what happened at all. But you know the the analogy makes sense. We sure leveled up, though, but, uh, oh my god. Trash it! Could you trash the game now and lose all the money you did for marketing and shit like that? It, oh my god. Let, let's go. Let's fucking go. Um, okay, they got a race. Here we go. Video playback, advanced cutscenes, AI companions, and rich backstory. Alright. Oh my god, I want to look at this. Uh, crawling in my skin. Here we go. The the dark, mature RPG for GameCube fans all over the globe. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna close my eyes for this one, so I won't see. Alright, here we go. I'm not, I'm not opening my eyes. Maybe it's, like, really good. Alright. I'm gonna open my eyes now. And probably you guys are like, oh my god, let's see. Opening my eyes. <gasps> oh! Trash! It's trash! Oh my god. Oh my god. Fucking. Fucking. Ow! Alright. Let's do a game report and then load up the game again. Oh my god, that was the worst! Oh, fuck! Oh, you know what the funny thing is that they only won the four, so it did meet the required rating, but... Like... What?! Oh, what a- what a tr trash game. Oh my fucking god. Uh, that's hilarious. Holy shit. They only won the four, and I did deliver a four, but... Oh my god. Multi-platform. These wounds will not heal. Let's see here. Platform GameSphere RPD bad. What the fuck? Hang on, platform genre match GameSphere RPD. Wait, are you telling me like the GameCube had bad RPD? Bullshit. Hang on, GameCube RPG. Yeah, dude, dude, dude. Dude, are you are you telling me that that Paper Mario was bad and like Crystal Chronicles was bad? You know what? M maybe maybe they were kind of right. You know, th this isn't like a huge library of amazing games here, but um, but Sky's of Arcadia as well. But that was more you know Dreamcast, but still, you know it, they, they were okay though. What what the fuck? Are, we should try to focus. I did put the entire team on here. You guys are crazy, you know that? You guys are crazy. I'm gonna load up. About a minute ago. About a month ago. Wait, what? Oh, 11 minutes ago. Well, how much did I... How much did I lose? Let's just see what, where I landed. This wasn't... Okay, okay, good. This was still what, where, where, when we were okay. And that's not safe scumming around, that's just learning from experience. The, the easy way. Mm. Uh, save scummer, cheater. All right, yeah. Let's see what else they have here. You know what we really should do? You know what we really should do? We should get... Wait, how, how the fuck is it that... 2D graphics... I can improve on that, but 3D graphics I can't? I gotta, like, get that first. It's just insane. Oh, Jesus. Anyway, let's just look at the, uh, the publishing deals. Hospital action. Is, Jesus. Mystery casual? 
Isn't isn't uh ghost ghost dog? No, not ghost dog. No, <laughs> not fucking ghost dog. What is it called? Ghost skulls. No. Uh, what is that one game with the the uh? You're playing a ghost detective. What's it called? Uh, ghost dad. No, that that's the one with uh, Bill Cosby. Uh, fuck. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> ghost Trick! There you go. Isn't Ghost Trick like a casual mystery game? Whatever. Or is that more like an RPG puzzle thing? Like, I don't know. I don't know anything about it. Ghost Trick. Yeah, there you go. Ghost Dad. Cop Dog is the worst movie ever made. Oh, fuck. But that's on the Xbox, which is fucking terrible. Um. Hospital action, rhythm, any genre, any, any, any genre rhythm. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I have an idea. What would we research? Uh, music, real quick, and then we can maybe get that back. You guys should see. Uh, you guys should see Ghost Dad. It's a great movie. It had B Bill Cosby in hell. Which, you know... Hey, hey you know, I don't want to make no Bill Cosby jokes, but... You know... This is too far from reality right now. Uh, anyway, uh, let's see here. Publishing deals. Music and a genre. Alright, I'm gonna make a rhythm... Rhythm thing. From, for the Xbox. From, for EA! Ooh, I'm in the devil zone now! Oh boy, I can't wait. Ah. There we go. Uh, what else do we have here? Um, how about everyone? Everybody and a casual music. <laughs> this is like really. Hang on. W no, no, dude. I I just fucked up real bad. Oh my god! I just realized what I did. Uh, you know what I should have had? I should have had rhythm music. No escaping now. You know what? You know what? Let's make it something incredibly shitty. And just as a joke, see what I can get away with. Cause I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I just fucked up bad. All right, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make, uh, I'm gonna make, uh, uh, the, the, the Sims, but with like you know a funny edge to it. So it's gonna be the, uh, the. Uh, I'm actually curious. What is what's the Sims in German? Hang on, the the Sims German. I got a German Shepherd, but uh, yeah, I guess it's the same in 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 in, in German. But I know this. I, I like how Sims is in, in Spanish. Los Sims, Los Sims, oh. I like that one. You know, wh wh what I thought, what I thought when I was younger that, uh... The, the Sims was... Wait, wait, no, bullshit! It is called this! You know... Die, Sims! Einfach Terich! That's right. That's right. That's my kind of game. <laughs> anyway, uh... The Sims... The Arschlocht... Und der... Uh... Fed... Fed... Uh... I'm gonna call this, uh, a fucking shitty game. Alright. Capish. You blew it. Let's, let's make something just incredibly, just, just fucking... Alright, you know. Uh, I guess game store and quest will not matter at all here. The engine is quite important, you know, I'm just gonna make... I, I don't give, give a shit, just... Let's go. Let's fucking go, dude. Alright. 
text-based music game. <laughs> Which can work. You know, ASCII letters that dance around. <laughs> I'll pay for that. Uh, dialogues. No. Level design has got to be important. And artificial intelligence, you know. Music. I guess just, yeah. I, I, I've just stopped caring completely. With quests and stuff. Oh my god, this is dumb as shit! Being honest increases sales, yeah, I, I guess. Look at all this, you know what, let's, let's also, while we're doing this, let's just market this as... Like, a large campaign for two million, yeah. And... Sound is obviously the best, and graphics, you know, world of sound, I, I don't know, uh, just... You'll do sound. Oscar, you will do, uh, this. Yeah, alright, just... What a fucking... Disaster of a game. You know it. You know it's gonna be released like a steaming number two on, t on the market. Look at this hype! It's almost 140, it's just... Oh, Jesus Christ. Alright, I don't expect this to be- If it is good, then I might even keep it, but... No, there's no fucking way this is good. You know it. Bullshit. Here we go. Yeah, 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 let's see, let's see here. Let's see here. <laughs> what, a five? No shit. Electronic mass productions require. Oh yeah, it re it's required standards. <laughs> oh Jesus! Look at this. Even though I delivered a another shitty game as a joke, I still didn't fuck up. <sighs> this is this is grand. EA didn't care. They said, you know what? Yes. It's just it just <sighs> art imitates real life. Thanks, EA. Holy fuck. Goddamn. Classic. Classic. Oh, uh, just... Oh, you... you f oh, fuck you. Oh, goddamn it. Alright, let's load this up again. <laughs> this time, let's just not fuck around too much. You really have to try to make a bad game, you know? I think that will be like the last game I ever make with Kosoga games. Just like, he's called it. It kind of reminds me of that one game, Shit. There's a game that's actually called Shit. Like, I'm not even kidding. There, there's a game literally called Shit. I gotta find it. Yeah, here we go. Would you play I should play this. This is my game right here. A classic. A classic game. A classic game. Alright. Why is it a classic? It's Shit! That's right. Shit! You know you gotta you gotta you gotta say this. You can't just go with shit. The game's called shit. It's the game's called shit. Can you imagine the brainstorming meter for this? You know, uh, <laughs> could you imagine the brainstorming meter for this while they're on their meeting? It's just like, so Johnson, you got a new game for us? Yeah, yeah, I do. I think this is gonna be a real good one. Uh, so we we you know Johnson and I. We've been, uh, we've been thinking, and I think the new game we're gonna develop is just gonna have a great title. Oh, that, uh, really? Yeah, it's called SHIT! Get a promotion right now. And they all just start, like, consuming feces, and just... And, uh, the game developer was actually called Konami. I'm going on vacation. That's what we all do. We don't even need to take vacation, but we can do it anyway, right? Oh, Jesus. Shit! A classic. A classic. Could you imagine if game, uh... Game developers, uh... 
did that today. They put this on the cover, like, not just calling it shit, no, of course, but I'm talking a classic game. Like, could you imagine if MGS5 had a Hideo Kojima game underneath it? A classic Kojima game. <laughs> <laughs> How fucking bold do you have to be, like, announce that the game is a classic before you release it? it kind of reminds me of what Disney did. Like, the Pokemon movie was called the first Pokemon movie. And, and think about it. I mean, they, they knew. They knew beforehand that the movie was going to be called the first movie. Like, they, they were going to make more. So they already knew. They were bold enough to say, you know what? This is the first one that we we're going to release. We'll make a couple other ones in like 10 years, whatever. But, like, I remember this This was being released this way. The first movie. The first movie. Like... Uh, I know that's not Disney, but I, I got sidetracked. No, I want to say, but Disney did this as well with other movies. Like, I don't forgot which one of this, like, you know, uh... Whatever. Disney. <laughs> Disney Pokemon. You know, but, uh, yeah, regardless. Alright. We should just, like, research a bunch of stuff. I can't do this yet. I can't do this just yet. A new topic. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna research music. It's gonna be a real... You might think this is a bad idea, but I'm gonna make new topics and eventually find something that might fucking work, you know? They were planning Back to the Future 2 before one was even released? Yeah, probably. I don't- I don't doubt that. Medieval! Medieval, dude! I've been doing dungeon RPGs! Dude, medieval RPG, yes! Yes! Dude, medieval dungeon R- but that doesn't even make sense. What's the difference between a medieval game and a dungeon game? It's like, dungeon games are set in a... You know, unless you mean like, you know, uh, the first Shin Megami Tensei, that was kind of dungeon-esque, I, I think. Shin Megami Tensei. <laughs> Game dev, yeah. Alright. I would like the, the cross-genre thing here, but, uh, yeah. I've never played Shin Megami Tensei, but, um... Uh, from what I- what I- it, it, is Shin Megami Tensei the one where you fight Hitler? No, that's- that's, uh, the first Persona, I think. Which, I- I gotta- I gotta say, like, if we're not gonna talk crazy fucking shit, you fight Hitler, which is in secret a- a Lovecraftian, uh, elder god. Um... Uh. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> multi-platform, that, that was the one. Wait, wait, hang on, Mul no, multi-platform is very different from multi-genre, because, you know... Um, oh, dude, that'd be great. Holy fuck. That'd be so good if I can port it. We should just wait for the multi-platform, maybe. I think you were really... Is, is Nocturne the one that has... Featuring Devil May Cry from the Devil May Cry games on the fucking front cover. Uh, oh, that's this fucking amazing. You know, maybe you should train these guys. Yeah, let's dude, go fucking train, dude. Wait, I, I can't do that actually. Practice, practice, practice. The pixel cup. Yeah, let's send this guy on here. What's the worst that can happen? <laughs> Yeah. Damn, son. Damn. Well, that's the one. Featuring Dante from Devil May Cry. You, you gotta give him credit. I mean, Jesus. Uh, yeah, let's just do a... Uh, let's do a medium booth this year. I, I kind of want to play it safe. Let's just not start dumping trash. Because regardless if I do a good or bad game, I'm still gonna save. You know, I don't like to save scum too much. There's gotta be fucking consequences to something. That's why I kind of like playing San Andreas with cheats on kind of gets boring for a while because you There's no consequence to what you're doing. You know, you got to have an element of losing to it but uh Why are you guys talking about vacation? None of these guys need vacation. They're all green The fuck are you talking about? 
All right, good. Oh yeah, I need like send this guy on vacation or this is half, dude. This half. <laughs> All right, so these he's a little researched up. You know what's? What are you talking about? Derek needs a vacation. Oh, I oh shit! I need to see Derek. Oh, De oh dude, dude, dude! You guys are right. Holy fuck. This was like camouflage. The, this, this thing, I thought this was like something on, on the actual, uh, uh, desk. I'm sorry. Holy shit. Holy fuck. <laughs> oh my god. I didn't see that, I'm sorry. And I sent on vacation too. We, we're kinda just sitting and doing nothing right now, but that's fine. It's fine. Alright. I don't know, I'm, I'm fucking blind sometimes, dude. Alright, good. 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 Let's see what publishing deals we have. Horror or any genre? Military RPG, hunting stretch. All these contracts just ass. Vonnie. <laughs> Vonnie. <clears throat> I'm a busy man, Derek. Um any topic. What 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 do you guys think? What do you guys think? Should we do this? I, I, I think we should publish our own shit. <laughs> Casual games for PS2. All I can think of this is... This fucking horrific, horrific fucking cover art for Super Busta Move on the PS2. A casual puzzle game like... Oh my god. Oof. Oh, that's good. That's fantastic. Oh, good god. Horror, any genre. They want a four. These guys want a seven. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you guys remember that thing? Oh my god, it's fucking hell. Fuck me. <clears throat> Haunting strategy. Uh... Deep Platinum. Silver Dollar Games. Uh, I've showed that in previous- yeah, I, I kinda forget. I got bad Alzheimer's. Um, uh, this would be interesting. A hunting strategy game. Which, for any- this is- this is like a- like a- like a trap awaiting to like get bitten in. It's just- no. I'm gonna wait until they give me pachinko games. That's what I'm gonna wait for. I don't make good horror games in this. I always suck at them. I don't. I, I have no intention of like losing money. So what I could do instead, I could um, make a new game, a large game, and I can do a medieval RPG on the PC. Yeah, I dude, I've done a bunch of dungeon games, but now, uh, uh, uh medieval dude. <clears throat> Yeah, should we go with it? Yeah. I call this uh, peasant uh, pussy. <laughs> uh, well, let's make Undertale more like over story. Uh, let's see here. Uh, Underjoel, medieval action. Which can't work, actually. You can't actually do that. Uh, medieval... yeah. Name, name one good medieval action game. This is not like a trick question, like, name one. I'm just curious, like... Uh, I can't really think of one that's really good. Medieval action game. And... Medieval doesn't fucking count, alright? So, mm, that doesn't count. Uh-uh. Chivalry. Chivalry? Yeah, that's good. I like how everybody said chivalry, but none of you guys said, uh, like, Mountain Blade, which not really is an action game, it's more like a, kind of a strategy game, you think about it. A little bit. Strategy elements to an action game, but, uh, yeah. Dynasty Warriors, but that's, that's not really medieval, that's more like, you know, uh, fantasy. 
I mean, would you really consider Dynasty Warriors like a, a fucking medieval game? But I, I don't know, but whenever I think medieval, I always think of like European medieval. I can't, I can't think of like other, other place medieval. Like medieval China sounds weird. It should be more like, oh, it's just the Great East fantasy, you know. Regardless, I'm gonna make another RPG. Uh, this one is gonna be called. Uh, You know what's gonna be? Uh, we're gonna call it. Uh, hmm. The Three Kingdoms is an historic event that happened. Yeah, I know that, but. Uh, uh, Witcher, dude. But that's an RPG. That's an RPG. What would Assassin's Creed be? Shit. Uh. <laughs> I don't like Assassin's Creed, I'm sorry. Uh, Dark Souls, so that's that's sort of like a hack and slash RPG, I, I don't know. Uh, hide Light. Uh, Jesus Christ. Oh, dude, you know what, you know what, you know what? I'm gonna call this... I'm gonna... No, it's called SHIT! That's what it is. <clears throat> uh, I don't know, what are we gonna call a medieval PC? Oh wait, I gotta pick R RPG, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm gonna call this, uh, Dragon, uh, uh, d d d Deuce. Or, you know what, you know what, I'm gonna call this, uh, Wizard Warmageddon. Gandalf's uh, rage. <laughs> so <it's not laughs> yeah, you play as a wizard and you battle each other and you just destroy the world. Yeah, fuck yeah. It's like Dragon Ball Z, but with wizardry. Dude, come on. Make it happen, son. We can do 2D graphics for this. You no, know, it's fine. It's fine, dude. And we'll market this as well. Magazine and demos. Oh, yeah. I'm kind of sad that demos are stopped appearing now because, um, you know, that's kind of what happens, you know, in the industry. You know, the, the, that that's, that's what kind of happened to the 360. They, you know, it actually had a bad effect on sales. People would download the demo and just play the demo and not give a shit about the real game. Uh, mainly because, you know, the 360 uh, audience is mainly kids. And they can't get that many games, you know. But, you know, a lot of older players probably, but, um, yeah. yeah. Game demos these days are, have a bad effect on sales, which is kind of insane, you know. Uh, but then again... Um, it seems game demos have become synonymous with, you know, fully released games these days, because, you know, uh, more Konami jokes, you know, but, um, psh. regardless, uh, let's make that happen. An engine, not really that important. All right, uh, yeah. Gandalf's Rage. What about timed demos? Hey, hey, hi, this is Jörg. Longer, from Game Nova. I got word that Kasso Games is working on a new game. Yeah, let's do an interview. Let's let's hype this up, which is... I don't feel too confident about, but... Alright. Uh, yeah, I'm on fire today. Well, early access, actually. Early access, that's right. Yes, another hype game, you know what? Yeah. Oh my god, this is the worst. I, I know this is gonna fail! They're gonna hate it! They're gonna fucking hate it! Alright, damn son, you, 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 you just take a break, alright? Take down the artificial intelligence a little bit. Increase the level design. Derek, you do that. Aren't... What does Aren't do? Hang on. Well, that, that's terrible, actually. Uh, give him back. Wait, Derek, Derek, Derek. 
What did Oscar do again? Aren't dude? No, 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 no. There we go. That's gonna be a good one, Derek. Why do people think that Undertale is medieval? Because uh, I don't know. They got kicked in the head. <laughs> oh my god! Look at the hype. Oh sweet! Can I mark it even more now? To a small campaign. Yeah, let's dump a small campaign. Nah, I should have done that at the start though. Yeah, just do a little magazine stuff. Alright, let's see here. Uh Sip. Oh, that's that that's bad. Uh damn. So what what does damn son do? He does two things now? <laughs> nuh uh. Uh what am I doing? Uh Oscar. Who does at least sip? Sip, you want to take this one? No, you don't want to do that. <laughs> sip does everything. No. Derek, uh, no, aren't you can do this? Aren't you can do everything? No. I think what I had at the start was the best, actually. Yeah, let's do that. How about sip? You you do this. I I I have the assets to do this actually. Yeah, yeah. Let's just, let's just do this. But Derek is kind of overworked. I'm gonna take this down. A, but that's the most important part. So I can do this. Oscar, you do this instead. Well, that no, that's bad. Damn son. What if Arnt does it? And Arnt does two things now. Which is not what I want. Can I remove him? And Arnt does everything again. They're gonna die. They're gonna die, son. So Arndt can do this, but that's 135. Um, not the best, but... Uh, that's how it's gonna be, man. Alright, let's, let's roll with this. Let's roll with this. Damn it, Art. We gotta have more people. We gotta have more people. Honestly. We can probably take this down and but that's the most valuable thing, dude. We can do this. We can do this. Yeah. Use Derek for design? That's true. Right, can I go back? Anyway, let's just go. Sounds needs to be a little bit higher. I, I think we're... Oh, dude, it's almost 200. This is this has got to be good. This has got to be good. Look. Oh, uh, 170 hype. Uh, pressure. Oh, my God. You guys ready for this juggernaut to be released? Holy fuck. Here we go. Oh, I'm going to close my eyes. I can't do it. I can't do it. Can't do it. All right, I'm gonna close my eyes. We close our eyes. All right, close my eyes. Can't look. Can't look. Can't look. Please tell me it's good. I'm gonna open my eyes. Oh, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. 8897, you know, all games fuck them, but, um, yeah, not too bad. There's a friend of mine is greatly involved in an organization which aims to get more women into technology. <laughs> not on my watch. Uh-uh. 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 Uh uh, get get out of here, women. You don't you don't belong in video games. Fuck off. You know, trigger warning. I'm I'm sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm I'm triggering all you. Uh, no 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 no. My 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 uh, my company is strictly men. Uh, just kidding. All you know, um, my jokes are written by a woman. I'm just kidding. We don't hire women. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm making a joke, for fuck's sake. Anyway, uh, yeah, let's sure. Uh, 
Uh, and if, uh, and an exclusive interview well I go damn son from the uh, very boy about their uh paper neighborly you were saying, oh yeah. Uh this was spot on I received very positive view. Oh this is a post yeah dude. Alright, how much is it's not selling like super much. Like I expected more. Gold, self out uh, without the help oh that was it. Yeah, I self published it, that was the thing, but whatever it is it's fine. Uh if they were, were, if the game were a music record, it would have gold status. Yeah. Gold is so games well done. Oh my god. <laughs> Highly priced. Uh, we would love to meet more women in the industry. Yeah. <laughs> Which, like, <laughs> people take this shit so seriously. Like, chill out. Fucking hell. Uh. Yeah, you know what? We can break one million. That'd be great. Can we? Can we? Yeah, one million. That's fine. Platinum! Sell one million copies of a game without the help of a publisher. Yeah, man. Look at that. Well done, man. Dude, we, we, we made money back, dude. Predicted they will see next generation of it in the early next uh, in the PC industry. I'll not be reflecting the gaming on the computer. It's a truly exciting way forward. Uh, let's see. Mbox 360. Oh, fuck you. Alright, let's see. You make way more when you self-publish. Well, that's actually good. Anyway, we need a vacation for this. Holy fuck, dude. Alright. <sighs> mm. A millionaire. Honestly, if I... If I really was a millionaire, I, it would be the worst thing ever, because, like, I would be, like, uh, Donald Trump. I'd just, like, swim in liquid money and, like, have have a, like, a sex robot made out of, like, platinum, and it ejaculates money into my asshole, you know. I, I would just make the poorest decisions in the world. I, I wouldn't be responsible at all, so uh, it's it's a good thing I live on ramen noodles. It's like a restriction. It's a it's a it's a it's a good thing I don't have money because if I did, we'd all be dead essentially. You know, I'd probably be like, let's make a nuke, and have the nuke explosion up blow, uh, up, but give all of us boners or something. You know, I. I just give the dumbest things, but anyway, uh, yeah, let's... We can do a large booth. Fuck it. See, the thing with Donald Trump, I don't want to get political and all that, but... I gotta say, people that seriously vote for, uh... What's his name? Uh, Donald Trump? It's sort of like electing the Monopoly man, or like the Pringles mascot. It's like... Doesn't people realize that Donald Trump is, is like... He's almost like a parody of a rich businessman. And him running for, like, president is almost out of a movie. Like an evil corporate guy. It sort of reminds me a little bit of Biff from Back to the Future. How Biff became rich and just ruined everything. It's just like, he's the president now. Like, it's insane what you can do with money. Like, I, I can't believe people are doing this. Like, you want a, a, a corporate businessman to rule you? I, 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 it blows my fucking mind. You know, it's sort of like almost... It, it, he's big this from... Yeah, dude, fuck. Yeah, let's see. 62, that's nice. That's nice. Butthead. I don't want to get political. I don't want to get poli- I don't know- Dude, I don't want to get political because I don't, I don't know anything about uh, Trump's actual politics. Uh, the only thing I know is- is that the man has written books like these. Hang on. Like any- any president that has a book that's called How to Get Rich. It seems kind of like, uh... Mm. 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 I don't know. I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about here, but uh <laughs> Or my favorite No such thing as overexposure 
Nobody regrets this book. Uh, knowledge. Knowledge. That's right. Uh, you know. And you want to know what I like more than materialistic things? Knowledge. That's right. Uh, oh yeah, uh, so we're on the great. you know what, let's do a fucking, uh, research here. Let's do a research, like they taught me at school. <laughs> Ty Lope is what a fucker. Oh my god. Knowledge. Knowledge, dude. It's fucking great. He my grudge. If you guys don't know who Ty Lopez is, uh, go on YouTube without ad block, and you will soon have a migraine. All right, and she's to be not important. Yep, I kind of figured that. All right, guys. Uh, now is the time to do a big research, like they taught me at school. All right. Uh, do you guys think... Alright, guys. Multi-genre or better 2D graphics? What do you think? Oh, fuck me. Knowledge. The goddamn... This new Lamborghini. Multi-genre. Yeah, let's do multi-genre. Could be really fucking good. And while we're doing that, let's also do a new topic, like, uh... Racing? Well, that's the thing with multi-genre. No, that's not multi-topic, but, um, yeah. Knowledge. Dude. Dude. Uh... Do I have to do a new a new engine to do... No. I don't need to do a new engine to do multi-genre, do I? No. That, that doesn't make any sense. Alright, multi genre. So I can do this and. Oh, oh, I can't! Look at, that, look at that! Holy fuck. Today, Micronosoft. I can't even pronounce that. Micronoft. Micronoft, which sounds like n uh, narcolepsy. Um, presented a new console called the Mbox 360. It's the first in the new generation of expected consoles and future hardware rivaling it. And. PC counterparts. With relatively cheap purchase price, Micronoff will be selling the device at a loss of the part the strategy of the game market. Alright, the reason I got a 360 when it was released was on the sole premise that it uh, was more like the games that I had a shitty PC. Console sounded better at the time. A lot of good games were coming out for the 360 at the launch. It, it was like, you know, Pro Project Gotham and <laughs> All those games, uh, Dead Rising as well. Like, I, not not exclusively the launch, but 360 had a really good library at the start. And here's the best part: it was really cheap. It's not until now I got a PS3 when I was really, really like at the end here, you know. Uh, but when the PS3 was released, you know, was it like six hundred ninety nine dollars or five hundred ninety nine? Like, just try explaining that to your mom, you know. Like, what? Five hundred dollars? You gotta get a job, Joel! And I'm just like, no, Mom. My job's, uh, you know, going on the internet and debating people. I am also a mass debater. 500, 509 US dollars! You know. Excited about new console, it's predicted the M Box will have a massive impact on the console market. We should do some M Box stuff, maybe. It's Rich Racer. You know, I I have to fucking do this real quick. I have to show the uh, Sony E3 2006. Like, we what a fucking travesty of a conference. Like, people make fun of E3 now, but they don't realize how fucking crazy bad it was. Like 2006. 2006 was like the magnum opus of bad E3s. Like. I think it was also the, the one with the, the Wii, where there was like a lady going around, I love dogs! Or something like that. Ah, a message, and the message was clear. 599 US dollars, but <laughs> we must take risks to reap the rewards. 599 US dollars, 
And we're not about cutting corners to rush a product to market. Whoops. And we're certainly not interested in gimmicks. Phil, today we have the eye of judgment. You see, I place a, a card into the screen, onto the screen here, and a what monster this game? This is cool. And we're certainly not interested in gimmicks, gimmicks, gimmicks. So you can position this next to your TV screen uh, and see for yourself what is coming up behind you. Where's for a tracer? Hang on. Fire and entertain fans around the world. Oh my god, this looks like shit. I heard that the graphics on it was crazy. <laughs> what? Did he really say that? And as the global leader, our mission at Sony Hang comes on. ability to offer the right product. Why did you enter the portal at Sony? PlayStation 3 is powered by Cell. We have invested billions oh, of yeah, dollars this stupid and shit. hundreds of thousands of man hours. It's a processor with power rivaling that of supercomputers, uniquely designed to support massive data processing required for digital entertainment. <laughs> <laughs> The essence of the PlayStation uh, DNA is real change uh, oh, that hell. has never been experienced at the next level. To oh, yeah. <clears throat> flip oh, yeah. over this crab on its back if he shows up, and you attack its weak point for massive damage. <clears throat> to the next level. Attack its weak point for massive damage. <clears throat> Our development teams all around the world, in all of our studios, have been hard at work converting that technology and vision into magic. <laughs> <laughs> Is this my fucking dad? Teams all around the world, in all of our studios, have been hard at work converting that technology and vision into magic. Holy shit, it's my dad! <laughs> <laughs> like I used to imagine this this fucking bald bald dickhead, this knobhead. Like, well, you see, guys, uh, we threw the magic box. Like, he's just got a bunch of like you know, uh, uh, smoke and mirrors. You know, he's got he, he's got he's got uh, like I, I can't even make a joke. What the fuck is that quote? Teams all around the world in all of our studios have been hard at work converting that technology and vision into magic. Yeah, I can just imagine Gandalf just appearing and he goes, you know, I am the sacred hard flame of Arno and you shall not pass, you know. He's a fucking wizard, this bald Sauron wannabe. Whoops. Another exciting aspect is the ability for consumers to make microtransactions 599 That's where that, that's where the fuck this fucking cancer started happening. Whoops. Another exciting aspect is the ability for consumers to make microtransactions Yeah, 2006, the start of this fucking plague we have now. 599 US dollars and we've been digging deeper and discovering what kind of muscle this machine really has. <laughs> <laughs> and you can see from all of the games that we have up and running on PlayStation 3 that we're really starting to push uh, what this machine is capable of. Real-time weapon change. It's exhilarating. <laughs> what they're creating for the PlayStation 3 is inspiring. <laughs> so uh, that sums up um, our playable section. But inside this body, we have added powerful and elegant system. PlayStation 3, I think it's a fantastic innovation. We have shown you that PlayStation 3 is the most advanced computer entertainment system in the world. I'm gonna beat you and it's gonna hurt because... Dude, they got me in the fucking ads. I I'm, I'm s fucking stoned and drunk and I'm just like, they're like, hey, th that asshole, you wanna be in the commercial? I'm just like, yeah, fuck you. And it's gonna hurt because I don't know. <laughs> Holy fuck. What a, what a year. But I, mean, I gotta show you this. Uh, uh, I gotta show you the, the, the best one. This is my favorite one. This, this is the best one. You can guess uh, what the title is gonna be by the way this game will actually start. As a matter of fact, this screen also brings back memories for me, for me as well. Um, I'm sure it does for some of you. 
uh, and I'm sure you're dating yourself by saying that you remember. I don't know if you remember this uh, particular uh, opening. This was actually on the original PlayStation game as well when it was loading the game. Of course, I'm not a very good uh, player even there. Game is powered by Namco. It's Ridge Racer. Ridge Racer. Remember that one? All right. So let me uh, let me go right ahead. Oh, fucking hell. What a year. What a fucking year, dude. What a fucking year. Like, it's Ridge Racer. And just everybody like, what? All right. Man, that, that was an awkward fucking year in, in the PlayStation, like, fan club. And all that, like, weird shit. Like, I remember everybody shitting on Sony. Like, they, uh... Sony got, had it real tough. Like, the PS3 had such a bad fucking time. You know, the PS3 was expensive, barely had games, and people were, like, taking the piss, like, there's no games for the PS3, and they just like, wow. And ironically, we, me with the 360 at the time was kind of, like, shitting on them as well. I was like, I don't want to get a PS3, fuck them. But the ironic thing is, the 360 started really strong with that simple uh, blade dashboard, you know what I'm talking about. No ads, great games, demos, all that. You know, years later, they got rid of that and started doing casual shit. Well, on the PS3, on the other hand, started doing good things and got cheaper. So it's kind of like they, they crossed I each other in quality. Like, they, the Xbox started good, PS3 bad. Throughout the years, the scales kind of like pfft, crossed each other, you know. But, uh, yeah. With the PS4 and the Xbox One, I, I, I don't know, I, I'm kind of not, like, interested at all. I just kind of play on the PC, you know? But, uh, dude, go on a vacation. The biggest, the, the funniest thing that ever came around that awkward era of PC, uh, not PC gaming, PC, PS3 gaming, or the console gaming shit in general, uh, the console wars, the Wii 360 and PS3, was Chad Warden. The triple baby. As baller as possible. That's right. Yeah, I can do this. We fly. We ha. You know it. Ugh. Fucking hell. My hair slick. I wonder what Chad Warden does these days. Fucking that guy made the internet have a, a simultaneous fucking aneurysm. Like people were so fucking mad at Chad Ward. Chad Ward was just this like guy that just took the piss. He did like this satirical video like uh, talking about the PS3 and how great it was. And people had a fucking nuclear meltdown. They're like, Chad Ward, you fucker, you know. I remember all the reaction videos on YouTube to him. Like people were legitimately really fucking upset with him and. I don't know, but, uh, anyway. 61, sweet. I gotta send him on vacation, yeah, I know. There we go. We could do our own research thing, yeah, but... he I think he works in business. Wait, wait, Chad Warden works in business these days? TS of War. It's a Wii Games. Shove it up your own ass game. I wanna play with no deal though. <laughs> um uh, anyway, Dave Johnson here, CEO of Departure Science. Some of our test subjects have been really exposed to some of our your games, and surprisingly, they didn't go totally insane. So what I mean surprisingly, uh they seem to be quite enjoy the experience, in fact. Anyway, I have some products and then the advertising goes to product placement. Product placement? My marketing boys tell me that making you this offer is a bad idea, but that's exactly why I want it. I'll pay you 200 to play some more fine red painted exploding barrels in our game. So, wow! Wow, I was talking about this earlier, about like, paid products and shit. Like, this is kind of like, close to it. Should we do it? Should we like... Came out to just fuck up? Dude, let's do it. Let's be an asshole. Let the corruption seep in. Yeah, sure. 
Excellent. Good to hear you have some spirit in you. One more thing. Don't feel like you have to go and rush those barrel city on next game. I'd rather have your place to make it with a fit well. Satan out. Oh. All right. I like making deals with the devil. You know, I wish I could cook with the devil. Um. What else? We go on vacation, you dumbass. The M box will be taken off the market. Game Sphere. Uh oh! Today, an inventor has announced their bid on the next generation calls for market by announcing the new. <laughs> what? You pick that game and not like the. <sighs> new. Instead of trying to compete with Mic Micronoft and Vonnie on the hardware strength and graphical power, the inventor has decided to deliver a truly unique gaming experience. Okay. Uh, how about we just do casual games for fucking Wii now? We just shovel. Yeah, dude, let's do shovelware, dude. No. First playtests were seen with a gr huge grins on their face. Seems like a lot of fun. Oh my god. Yeah, dude. We can do cross platform shit. We can do cross-platform shit. Sports casual Wii? Oh, dude. 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 Hang on. 2D graphics. Well, we're gonna have to do it with shitty graphics. That's just that's just how it's gonna be. Alright. I can do warrior wear, dude. Yeah. Alright. We're gonna pick casual. Simulation on the Wii. Oh, it's not out yet. Holy shit. Okay, maybe not. But we can pick. Uh, do I have sports? Sports, 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 sports. I do have sports. All right, we're gonna make. We're gonna make fucking uh, Wii sports. I mean, new sports. Oh my god. I, I hope Vinny can play some of this shit. Hey, Bacon. <clears throat> All right. M box no longer support. Game no longer support. All right. Roll it in, baby. <laughs> UFO. <laughs> uh, you know what I could do? I can I can pick a new topic real quick. Like just racing might be really good for this. Yeah, let's do racing and see what we get. Make the F Zero game Nintendo won't. It seems the market responds particularly well to games with new tops at the moment. Well, good, good. Let's do fucking new topics then. Trash. All right, so let's see here. Research, we have... Oh, I can't even do that yet. But I can do racing real quick. All right. Can can fucking the, the Wii get released, please? <clears throat> racing with red barrels, that, that'd be great. Super Quario Kart. There you go. There you go. Yeah. Yes. All right, now let's quickly get this shit out. But any before we do that, though, let's see... Um, any topic adventure life any genre no, I'm just gonna I'm gonna self publish this crap I'm gonna make a large one everyone it's gonna be a uh, racing simulation and casual uh, this seems like a bad idea uh, do you think this is a good idea simulation and casual let now nah, that uh, I should do sports instead. Let's do sports, and then do that other thing, yeah. On the Wii, yes, game engine runs on cool. And it's gonna be called, uh... Alright, now we're gonna go back, we're gonna go back to, uh... Action casual, wait a minute, pick your owner, I'm sorry. Uh, simulation. Is simulation sports? Yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna go most ridiculous real real sports. I I, I sometimes look at this because I gotta have inspiration. Uh top ten. Let's see here. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Uh Ten, 16 unbelievable. I can't believe I'm on BuzzFeed, but uh, yeah, it'll have to do just for inspiration here. Let's see here. Econo Kanto, what is this? Uh, what is this? It's an honored 
tradition of wife carrying race. Wife carrying. Uh, Buscazi. Polo. Chess boxing. Pato, which is a uh, horseback game. Yak racing. Fuck yeah, I'm into. You can do that. I'm drift champion in yak racing. Hurling. Is that Jeremy Clarkson? Yagli Grease. Which. Isn't that uh, oil wrestling? That one Street Fighter character does? Yai Alai. CPAC Tacro. Bossa Ball. Caber Toss. Ferret Leg. Ferret Legging? An endurance contest in which ferrets are trapped in your pants, and with that, they're biting. All right, yep, 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 yep. Ferret legging. The game. <clears throat> All right, cool. With red exploding barrels. Yep. Oh. Alright, uh, quests and <laughs> story can In the ancient ages, in an age where Morgoth had ruled the earth, and Eternia was filled with the Nubians, an ancient race of ferrets bit the dicks off the hobbits. Like, yeah, that story. Gameplay should be good, and engines should be good as well. I don't think story and quest should be uh, that important. All story, yeah. But one ferret was different! You see, Lemmy Winks, you know. <sighs> Fuck me. Can I do seven like that? Uh. <laughs> Way fix. Hey, this is Christopher Rignall from eGaming Check. I got word that he's working on a new game. Yeah, you know, yeah, it's gonna be a hyped game. Hang on, let's see here. Many of our readers are curious about how decisions go into making a video game and how companies prioritize development areas. Your new game is a sports ca simulation casual game. You can tell me whatever you receive more focus. Uh, well, we gotta have more artificial intelligence, because, you know, that's importante. Yeah. 2D. You know, int artificial intelligence on the ferrets when they bit my nuts off. Alright. Thank you for your time. Alright. I need that ferret AI, dude. Uh, artificial intelligence is of particular importance for such a game, but it seems that the other industry professionals disagree with the point of saying that sound is usually more important for this type of game. Well, you don't know anything, you fucking idiot. All right, <laughs> level design, artificial intelligence. Yeah, man. What do you think? What do you think, huh? My. I don't steal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck, fuck 3D graphics, dude. Fuck them. <laughs> I think we can do it like this. Hype it up. Should we need like a huge campaign for ferret biting? Yeah, it's more important. Yep, there you go. Less dialogue, we can do that. Fish AI. You know, th this is like a joke game. Like a joke game. Let's do marketing. Just do a, a large campaign. Oh my god, it's so stupid. Yeah. Trish. I should really just do 3D games and just try to, like, eventually get that up, but, um... World design, don't need that. Graphics and this is most important. Dude, damn, son, you should fucking do some stuff. You can work on the graphics, man. And Derek, you do that. And, and sip... No, hang on. There we go. Trish! Alright. Put red barrels in a me medieval game named Dwarf Mania, brother. Yeah, I, I do that. Um, wait, you guys think this is a good idea? Just release it now. Yeah, I, I, I'm game.
I'm game for sure. Here we go, guys. <laughs> this will be like a four. I know, I know, it's just gonna be terrible. It's gonna be fucking terrible. Uh, yeah. Alright, guys, will it do it? Oh, yeah, Derek should do this. Alright, let's do this. I need a new game engine, yeah, for sure. Alright. I did save, too. Just in case. Because I, I know this is going to be a terrible thing. Do a large... Let's just dump a bunch of money into nothing. That's what you get when you're a big company. You can just do crazy shit that's terrible. You know? We could do... You know, honestly, I'm, I, sh I shouldn't even, like, reload the thing. Because I got so much experience from just, like, doing a bad game that I can take it for better things. Like 2D graphics, for example. I don't know. Sound us up as well. All right, here we go. And race. All right, soundtrack. All right. Vonius announces successor to the massively successor successor, massively successful play system too. The PlayStation Three, five hundred ninety nine US dollars, and comes with an impressive hardware configuration, making the most powerful console in gaming history. They also, did this is a Blu-ray. A Blu-ray. Which Vonny hopes will success through the DVD format. Uh, hefty price tag, yeah. Expensive console ever, yeah. Don't I know that? See so, how consumer will react to given the lower cost alternatives. However, considering the mass success of the PlayStation 2, Vonny can be hopeful. Yeah, I don't know about that. Alright, guys. I'm gonna close my eyes. Close my eyes for this one. Here we go. It's gotta be total fucking trash, I know it. It's trash! Trash! Alright, I'm gonna close the open my eyes. What?! Alright guys, uh, we are in the fucking gravy. I knew ferret legging would pay off, and, uh, boy did it ever. Boy did it ever do it. Oh, shit. Well, I did a massive, massive campaign sale on this, and it sure fucking paid off. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Wait, I didn't make it into the top, but still, whatever. Uh, I think, yeah, 61, that's fine. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Dave Johnson here. Listen, those red exploding barrels I asked you to put on me. Well, seems that folk didn't really enjoy them as much as in the ferret legging. Okay, well, worth a try. Well, fuck you, man. We gotta have red barrels soon. Oh my god. Oh god. If we can break, nah, I don't think that we can get a million, but uh, 500 sales. Yeah, I didn't even need, I just gotta self-publish all my other crap, you know? Maybe we can go for one million. Another memorable game by Kosoge has been released. Truly outstanding visual design is one of the many reasons why favorite legging the game it serves your attention. To Kosoge game, keep the hits coming, please. Yeah, I'll keep the hits coming, and you'll take the hits to your nutsack by ferrets, my friend. One million! One million! Woo! 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 Come on! Yeah! One million! One million, baby! Yeah! Come on! Yeah! Yeah! One million! Yeah! One million sales. The excitement around in the game seems to have no end. Holy fuck. Alright, now, now I'm in that position where uh, I've got so much money that I don't know what to do with it. Visual dick biting. You know it. You fucking know it. One million. One million. It plays sort of like Eminem Racers <laughs> with the graphics of a ASCII game. <laughs> oh my god. Holy shit. 
<clears throat> I am a giant in the gaming industry now. In what some call a bizarre show of arrogance, Vani representative has been trash talking Micronov's successful Mbox while praising their own upcoming PlayStation 3 in the lead up to their launch. Oh my god, yeah. Asked about the initially high price of the Play System 3, a high ranking company official replied, People will work more hours to buy one. We want people to feel like they want it more than anything else. Just. We're, we're not sure that people really want it so badly as far as... No major game titles have been announced for the PlayStation 3. Uh, it, it might be a while before developers yet. <sighs> Alright, you guys need a break. You guys need a fucking break now. You too, buddy. Alright, let's 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 do a game report. Th this game was fucking great. It had been released. Alright, I don't want to trust that. We have 80 research now. We can probably do uh, better graphics, 2D graphics. A million in sales. Fucking tight, dude. dude. If we can get fucking 100, that'd be amazing. Come on, can you do it? I don't think we can. Three, four, four, four. One more, one more, one. Yeah, yeah 100, sweet. All right, now we can research something really fucking good. We can uh, do this. We can research uh, multi-platform. Dun dun dun! Yeah. Fuck yeah! Let's do. Should we do multi-platform? That's great. Then we can milk shit even more. Fuck yeah! Let's do it. I mean, money train doesn't have any stop now. Fuck me. I should probably save as well. Damn, son. Damn. Yeah, new engine for sure. But I can't do that yet. I mean, if I did an engine, like, what, what can I add that's new? Like, an open world? Like, just sucks. You guys want a new engine already? When I have, like, nothing really researched for it? What, with open world? Alright, open world, here we go, fine. It's gonna be, uh... Runs on... Ferrets. Are you really sure I should do this? You gotta get better 3D graphics, yeah, we should probably do that. But I am gonna get a new guy. You, give, you show my game demo, dude. The Fox Engine. Yeah. Alright, so we've got Cameron Stevenson, Alicia Harmon, Dalton Clayton, and... And me! Oh! Hang on, I gotta give this guy a little, little nickname. Joel Massbates. You know. That's me, man. Should we get Joel? Yeah. You should. He's not the best, though, actually. Uh, this is... Dude. Alicia's fucking great. Alicia's really good. She's cheap, too. Which sounds dirty, but no. Uh, but Cameron is level 3, dude. But... His speed is kind of slow. I kind of like Alicia, actually. She all is kind of shitty, yeah. Mm. I say we go for Alicia. Alicia. Ali Alicia or Alicia? I don't know. She's cheap, too. Alright, let's do it. I'm an employee of the Environmental Protection Agency, and I have an offer for you. Your company has a high electricity footprint right now. If you want to install solar panels, you could decrease your footprint and save money in the long run. We would sponsor 50 of your costs if we bring your investment to 200k. Would you like... What is this? What is this stupid shit? No! My company runs on children's tears and blood. What the fuck? Environmental, please. Ugh. 
Ugh, no. Thirty eight client offer. Oh, don't, 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 don't say that. Now I feel like a dick. All right, put him in. Put him in. I guess it's too late now, though. But, um, but are you? Do you already need that vacation? Hang on. You gotta. You, you gotta be trained, dude. Get a little welcome training. All right, all you guys. Uh, I guess there's not a lot of things happening right now. Destroy! Hack the planet! Hack the planet! <laughs> yeah, I should see. Uh, let's see here. Uh, PlayStation Two will take it off the market. The biggest fuck up for me when it comes to new consoles is no backwards comp comp compatibility. Compatibility. Yeah. If the PS4 had fucking PS3 and PS2 backwards comp, it'd be perfect. It'd be so good. But no, at least Xbox One has somewhat, like, you know, backwards, but, like, Jesus Christ, dude. Anyway, today, Grapple, alright, uh, a company well known for their role in the early PC industry, and more recently for their portable music player, DearPod, have announced that they will soon release a powerful new mobile phone, the phone is touchscreen, alright, gotta make, uh, flappy dongs. Fine, Com compatibility. Compatibility. Comp titties. Alright. The integrated graphics chips that should allow the phone to run games and since this comes it could be great for delivery. Ew. Mobile gaming. Ew. Still a large booth, let's just keep up pumping out trash. Oh my god. Alright, yeah, I did release one game and it kind of sucked, but that's the way the cookie crumbles. Strategy games are especially popular. Uh, how about we release something quick, a strategy game, on the PC? I say we go for it, dude. But actually, I'll be right back, said Titan. and uh, yeah, I, I'll be right back. Hang on. Alright, I'm back. Uh, yeah. Alright, uh, ferret legging. People love the shit out of that one. Well, it wasn't like a straight 10 out of 10, but it was still really good. Like, it smashed my expectations. Yeah. 52. We're, we're, we're like, slowly climbing up to, like, the start, dude. Alright, uh, so strategy is really important right now. Uh, See publishing deals. Oh, look, look, PCs have been upgraded now. Zombie adventure, detective energy. Oh, dude, we can do literally make uh, mystery ghost time. Fuck, what is it called? Uh, ghost trick. See, I'm not that stupid. Fashion simulation. Oh yes. Hmm. Uh, mystery any genre. What do you think? Don't you have some old strategy games you can make a sequel to? That's true, actually, but... I don't know, that'd be kind of bad, <laughs> in a way. Let's see, strategy, strategy... Military strategy, this one sucked. Complicated combat. Dungeon RPG, simulation... Strategy? Don't get caught jacking off. Hot dog eating car. I forgot I made a bunch of, like, stupid sport games. You know. Uh, simulation... I haven't done, done any real strategy games, but, uh... Ufo Porno, the classic. Make a sequel out of this! Detective Adventure. Who ate the last pizza? Oh my god. Damn, son! I should make a sequel to this! <laughs> uh, let's make a new game. Oh yeah, I can make pla cross-platform shit now. Uh, how about I make a... A casual... Uh... Uh... Strategy. Would that work? Would that work? Casual strategy. Kinda. I mean... Maybe. What do you think? What do you think? Should I? Where did the soda go? 
<laughs> no, nah. How about we do uh simulation strat? What what is a good strategy? What 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 is strategy good with? Action strategy. I mean, maybe. Isn't isn't like MOBA technically that? You know, action strategy or or like yeah, that's kind of it. Action strategy. You know. I think so. RPD strategy. What, what like fire emblem? All right, fine. We'll do that. So I'm going to pick this on it's going to be on both the Wii, uh, the PC, and the, uh, the, uh, the GS. And that's RPG Military, uh, like, that's it. RPG Strategy, this, this could be a real disaster, like, if this one sucks, it's, it's a real bad one, you know. Um, I'm gonna make a large one. DS does not support larger game. Oh, fine medium then, you jackass. The new pick topic. Where do I have a topic for this? Racing RPG strategy. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> PC and GS. Well, they can make out like a shitty port. That's what they did with sport games, you know. Uh, a racing strategy. Oh my god. Uh, dungeon sports. I don't know what 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 makes a good strategy RPG. Uh, this is like a terrible combination. What the fuck? Music action. How about a martial arts casual uh, simulation? <laughs> like, this is so stupid. Uh, uh, shit. I don't know. Card games on motorcycles. <laughs> uh, Ufo porno, cyberpunk. Nah, I, I, I honestly don't know what goes with the strategy. I, I don't know. RPG strategy. That's gotta be it. Like Final Fantasy Tactics, uh, medieval, kind of. I can try. I can fucking try. How about cyberpunk? Maybe. Well, I've done that in the past, but uh, um, I can another make a dungeon game. Medieval, medieval RPG strategy for the Wii, PC, and the GS. What guys say? Yes. Should we do this? Make the house game here. Yeah. <clears throat> hmm. Casual strategy is plants versus zombies. You know. Sounds good. All right, <laughs> here we go, guys. Here we go. I I'm not feeling too confident about this one, but um, this is gonna be uh, this one will be uh, 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 uh wizard. This is gonna be like a weird sequel, kind of. War my get get <laughs> can't spell. Right, War my get them. Uh, Sauron's, uh, Syphilis, Syphilis, alright, Sauron's, s s uh, uh, I don't know, uh, or, I don't know, multi-plat, Mush. <laughs> oh, dude, 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 dude. Uh, I have an idea. Um, Sauron's. Uh, uh, no. Uh, no. Uh, no. Uh, Sauron's. Skateboard. Skateboo. Skates. <laughs> <laughs> All right, two D graphics. This is what I do best. Two D graphics. Here we go. You know it. I could try practice more. 
you know what? I can do a gamble here. I can do more 3D graphics, so I eventually get that up better. Uh, what do you guys say? 3D graphics this time to just learn more about it. Yes? Graphics. Siren Skateboard. It's 90s and it's extreme in the 2000s. Oh my god. Uh, Text-based. Yeah. Now we're talking. We're gonna go with 3D. Oh my god, what a what a fucking disaster this is gonna be. It's gonna be a fucking disaster. Oh lord. Alright, uh, story quests. Because it's medieval strategy, so... Engine won't be that important, I think. Something like this. As usual. I mean, I'm, I'm quite experienced with RPG, so... But strategy, gameplay's gotta be important as well. So this, this should really just be like this. The engine shouldn't be that much. Um, what do you guys say? Yeah? Something like this? I can take down the engine, I think, a little bit. Maybe, maybe... Yeah. Hmm. Oh, it's cheesy porno. Ooh. Mmm, now we're talking. Yeah. Let's go with this. <laughs> Just a Frank bro. Oh my god. <clears throat> I never played Warsong. War, war, Warsong. Fuck the engine, dude. Marketing. Let's market this. We have the money, so we're gonna do a large campaign. Which again, this could be a fucking disaster, but I'm gonna I'm gonna take the loss because you know it's no fun if we're just gonna fuck up and just reload. So you know what? We'll take a loss. We'll take a loss if it does. You know. Oh man. Does Alicia need more training? Nah. Alright, so, um... Uh, dialogues... Artificial intelligence can... Kinda go down. Like this. Um... War Songs was supposedly the direct competitor to Fire Emblem Advance Wars, but didn't plan pan out so well. Okay. Mm, Mid AI. All right. There we go. Level design is kind of like this. All right. I think this is good. I think this is good. Here we go. Yeah, a little bit more, kind of. Sort of like here. Fish AI. Less the sign. You sure about this? Because it's strategy. That's that. Sh AI should be important. Yeah, I don't think level design is important at all. All right. AI is less important for this combo. God damn it! You sure about that, Brittany? The sign is better than AI. Less dialogue. Less dialogue in an RPG strategy. What the hell? It's gotta be important, dude. Less dialogue. You sure about that? Really? But RPG is like super important, dude. Right, you guys are crazy, but this is so confusing when like everybody has an opinion and I gotta listen to everybody in chat and there's just like it becomes a too many cooks in in the kitchen or whatever you say. Alright, you sure about this? Dialogue, level the sign in this. This this has gotta be. AI should be lowest. AI is important for strategy, yeah. So I I think something like this should be the best. Dialogue means the least in this. Dialogue and AI could be the same. I'm gonna go with this. I'm gonna go with this. Well, yeah, it's true. The RPG strategy. Too many cooks in my butt. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna go with this. We'll see how it pans out. We'll see how it fucking pans out. It'd probably be a disaster, but... Uh, I did marketing, yeah. Oh, lord. It's pretty funny that I'm actually publishing my own shit. You know. 
Lisa, you you gotta work some too, dude. Dude. What else can I do? Market. Dude, let's let's send us a magazine of demos. Get some crap on that as well. All right, Lisa, Lisa. We're not even at. Damn, son. All right, so here. Let's see graphics. Strategy. Isn't world design here like important or? Uh. 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 Worldless sound's gotta be. Hi, dude. World and graphics. Sound? I don't think that's super important. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. Let her do the sound. Let her get some skills on that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Graphics, high, low, mid. Are you sure about that? I mean, I, I'm, I'm trusting you guys on this. I, I'm not too familiar with the cross genre shit. Like, usually with RPGs on its own, I, I'm good with. Uh, but... All right, guys. Reduce the graphics a little bit. All right, here we go. It's gonna be a fucking disaster. It's gonna be a fucking disaster. Yeah. She, she's gonna make. She's gonna. She's. The soundtrack will be nothing but Alicia going. <laughs> People are like, wow, this is this is really like astonishing stuff. It's like highly praised, and she's just going. <laughs> You know, machine guns. Explosion. You know. Less graphics, tad more sound. I don't know about that. Uh, Alright. It will be MIDI. <laughs> it will be MIDI. Which actually is, isn't that funny if you think about it. Because DS games are MIDI. They are MIDI. You know. Uh, but... Uh, Great. You know what? I'm gonna go with this. I really don't think this is gonna be good at all. I think it's gonna be a fucking crap game. Uh, this Jurgen Jer Jurgen from Game Noah. I got the words to let me share, man. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Do you think the game will be well received? Yeah. Every time. In fact, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna solidify that this will. Pro oh my god! Look at all that hype. Oh no. It's almost up to fucking 200. Oh no. No, 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 it's gotta be hype every time, dude. Oh. My god. Oh no. I can't, I can't look at this. I can't fucking look at this. I cannot fucking look at this. Here we go. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. I, I can't look at. Aren't you? Alright. I can't look at this. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. I'm gonna close my eyes. It's gonna be the worst game of all time. I know it. I'm gonna open my eyes. This is gonna be a fucking travesty. Oh, it's gonna suck ass. It's gonna suck ass. It's gonna suck ass. Oh. Oh. All right. Open my eyes. Oh fuck yeah! Yeah! What the hell? Not bad, dude. <laughs> I expected this to be total crap, but yeah. Oh fuck. Not too bad. Uh, making more money. Oh, dude. Oh, <laughs> damn it, we keep making money, man. Oh, damn it. You know, because uh, uh, we were both about the uh, for you were successful, all right? You're some market because of the spot on this really for Oh, man, now it's gonna like break into a million again, probably. We have we have some like major cash now. Dude, remember Siren Skates? It was so cool, dude. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. 
Holy crap. A million. Competitors have been observing muttering jealous remarks. Oh my god. 250 fans. Such a big fan base, should they be able to self-publish large games? Yeah, oh, that's what kind of been doing, dude. Dude. Alright, all you fuckers go on vacation now. You've earned it. All five of you. Which is like, yeah, try try running a big company like this. With that little people, like, yeah, good fucking gravy. Let's do a game report here. Sour and skates. Like this post of Sour and Skates was your childhood. Oh my god. I wonder if we can get, uh, not a hundred, but let's see what else we have. Oh, nice. I think it's time for a new engine. Platform genre, new RPG is bad. Okay. Well, it was multiplat. It was multiplat. Any publishing deals? Hospital simulation, which it could be really good, actually. This could be really fucking good. Hospital and simulation is like real good. Time travel adventure. You know, I, I don't even give a shit. If this even was bad, I'd play it anyway. Dude, should we do this? Hospital simulation. That'd be great. Surgeon sim, dude. Surgeon sim. It's not at the market, yeah. But let's let's do some research first. I want. I can't have 3D graphics yet. That's kind of bullshit. Uh, what I can get though is I can get uh, 2D graphics V3. <sighs> so stupid. But I could get it for the DS. I could get it for the DS. 2D V3. I mean, I could. I could, dude. I could. <laughs> Rich backstory. Yeah, AI companions. Should do that. Advanced cutscenes. Yeah, let's do advanced cutscenes. That, that that that'll that'll be gravy. And while we're doing that, we can also get uh, a dialogue tree. <laughs> yeah. There you go. This should be good for the RPD crap we're doing. Large booth this year, man. <sighs> I mean, th th this 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 stream has been nothing but like money raking in. It's kind of insane, but. Um, yeah. Dialogue tree. Yeah. Alright, let's see here. Uh, let's do... I mean, if I did a, a new engine, like, it would just be the same shit, really. But... Whatever. I'll do it. It doesn't cost that much, really. Alright, this one will be... Uh... It's not really a waste of money, because I have so much money. Uh, this is- this is gonna be, a uh, Ferret... Engine. 2002. Yeah. Put our- pull all of our- all of our... things in here. Alright, a lot of people this year. Uh oh Oh, shit! Oh, not quiet, but still. 49, dude, nice. Blop. Alright, sir. Dear estimate. I'm financial advice to CEO at the v v Volbakia Oil Limited in Nigeria. Oh, am I getting scammed by Nigerian princes? Uh, people? Alright, I'm writing because I know you have your high res repute trustworthiness. RC has organized me to invest. Okay, uh, you, you're crazy. Wait a minute. Hang on, what? Two five million in Kuso games. Yes, that is me. Uh, that's a good idea. Yeah. All I gotta say about this is this. Hang on. Oh! 
poverty no good at all. No. Now he make I join this business. For one night is no bitch. It's just a game. Everybody is playing. If anybody follow me, go. Ah, my brother, I go jump up. National Airport, let me get down. National Stadium, let me build down. President, now nah, my sister, brother. Thank you, man. I think that's the I think that's the perfect subtitle to uh, uh, this. I go take your money and disappear. I go take your dollar. I go take your money disappear. For one man is just a game. You are the loser. I am the winner. Seems legit. <laughs> no. Ferret engine. All right, it's it's complete. All right. Grapple. The company responsible for the massive success of gr Griffon has announced their plans to re release a tablet device called the Gripad. Gripad. Uh, that was the new idea. DR pad. You know. So I guess I'm in like the 2000s, late 2000s now. Like 2009, I guess. Which is really scary because, like, we're moving into the future here. I wonder if the game will treat, like, PS5 and shit like this. Just, like, ridiculous stuff. But, uh, yeah, I guess we gotta see if there's any publishing deals here. Uh, business simulation. Oh, yeah, that's fun, fun, fun game. Let's make a new game. Uh, on the ferret engine. Let's pick a... Let's make a sequel, man. Let's make a fucking sequel. Let's make a sequel to ferret legging. Yeah. But this time, it's also on... Uh, the Mbox. The PlayStation. On the phone as well. <laughs> so the PlayStation and the Wii. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Pick genre: casual, casual. Uh, simulation. All right, sport, sports. How about when you like, dude? Let's do a racing game. It's just like ferret racing, ferret racing, man. Oh my god. Uh, and what would that be? I guess... Action... Simulation? Right? Racing. That, that should make sense. That's what racing games are. They're action simulations, right? <laughs> On the ferret engine. <laughs> uh, fer ferret... Racing. Tokyo Drift. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. From what I've seen so far, how are you feeling about Dark Souls 3? Uh, I, I've lost interest. Dark Souls 2 was such a fucking disappointment, I stopped caring. Uh, sorry, I, I gotta be honest. Dark Souls 2 was such a stab in the heart for me. Like, it was so underpolished, and what a fucking letdown that I don't want, I don't want to play. I mean, I'll play Dark Souls 3, but only if it has the p same polish and just goodness of the first one. Yeah, but uh, since Dark Souls 2, I, I, just, I just... The hype died down completely. I haven't seen it, though. I haven't seen it. I've seen a screenshot, and, you know... How about this? Make for more lo uh, Lorder and shit. Make more stories about Nido and, and what happened to, you know, the the Undead King and all that. Like, fuck. Stop making new stories, dude. I want I want some closure. I don't know. I mean, Dark Souls 2 was fine. It was fine, but... You know, it wasn't good enough. I'd say it's a 6 out of 10. I, I really fucking hated how the levels were not it, w with each other. Like, there's a new zone you gotta go to to, like, get to it. Like, fuck that. I like when the world is connected. I really love that. 
and uh, I don't know, Dark Souls 1 is just a classic. Dark Souls 2 doesn't hold a fucking candle to it. I don't remember anything about Dark Souls 2, but I do remember is Dark Souls 2 just reusing assets, like, for no reason. Like, uh, you know, uh, Sunbro stuff and, and Havel. Like, what? <laughs> Uh, I don't know. I, I did not like it at all. I, I hated that fucking soul memory shit. It's so stupid. But anyway, let's keep going. Let's do marketing. Let's do a large campaign. And again, I, I can afford to do that because, you know, Bloodborne was a return to Fortnite. Yeah, that's a problem. You know, I don't have a... It appears that recently a few companies have fallen victims to Nigerian scammers. The scammers often claim to invest large sums of money into companies that require a sizable upfront payment to make a deal. Yep. Who may on advice to pay they will not see their money again. Police are investigated. For one man is just a you are the loser. I am the winner. <laughs> Nigerian princess, dude. Alright, we got advanced cutscenes. Alright. So, story quests. And the engine should be good as well, because it's racing action simulation. It, it, this is like Project Gotham or Gran Turismo or. Uh, fuck, you know. It's one of those games. I am the wiener. I am the loser. I know all about Nigerians, dude. Dude, I'm, I'm, I'm like half Nigerian myself. Uh, maybe not, but. Uh, Nigeria is a crazy country. I love their movies. Tabatsatsula! Who killed Captain Alex? Walalala -la -la action! Walalala! -la -la. We do the best movies. Ramon Film Production presents the Gabli Chung. Uh, um, yeah, we gotta have a good engine, dude. Devil May Cry. Uh, less story, even less, yeah. I yeah, yeah, all right. That's Uganda. Fuck me. Fuck me. That's that's fucking not Nigeria. That's you, you, fucking Uganda, dude. Goddamn. Fuck, I'm dumb. Fuck, I'm dumb. I'm as dumb as those people that confuse Switzerland with Sweden. You know. No, I, I now I know the 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 Ugandan rage. They're gonna get Captain Alex on my ass. All right, engines gotta be good. Gameplay's gotta be top. Top, top dog. We should make a game about the Nigerian scammers. Call it that one time I almost got robbed. LOL. <laughs> Classic. Um, Alright, yeah. iPad, whatever. Who gives a shit? Alright. Uh, didn't I just do another campaign to like... I cannot do another campaign? That's just insane. Put in magazines, dude. Who, who knows? Simulation games. Oh, yeah! Perfect, 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 per if, if I can sell this, if this sells while simulation is active, we're gonna be in the gravy so much. You know what? I'm gonna market it again. Yeah. Hype the shit out of it. Oh my god. Make it on the f Has there ever been a good racing game on the iPhone? Like, yeah, like, Flappy Birds Racer Edition. No dialogue. Um, intelligence. I guess that's important. Level design? Uh, at least, you, you dumbass, you, you can... Well, sip try to do something, right? Yeah, that's better. Uh, dude, marketing. No, there's never been a good... No. I don't think so. Uh, rubber brand AA, AA, AI. Uh, yeah, I think this is good. Dialogue tree, yeah, dialogue tree. Let's just put irrelevant shit into it, because, you know, who knows? No dialogue, uh, level design, because it's racing tracks, dude. And artificial I think this is good. I'm gonna go with this. Yeah, baby, you know it. <laughs> you stop using sip on dialogues. <laughs> what do you mean, Sid Meier's not good for dialogue? Well, he's a liar, so he should. 
be good. Why are you making a, a tech guy do dialogue? Because tech guy is stupid. <laughs> Alright. This one doesn't have as much uh, hype, but I don't care. It's fine. It's fine, dude. Alright. Uh, Derek, world assign. Uh, which is, you know, gotta have that. Graphics and open world. Dude, that's important. How about this? Sound is like, yeah, you know, car, car engine sounds. But graphics, dude. People love graphics in this. I think we should do this. Graphic, people love graphics in racing games, so... Get the sound down. How about this? I think sound is, like, more important, actually. No world design. Graphics and sound, that's that's the most important thing, I think. I think this, this will be it. What if Oscar does it? Well, she need she needs the training, dude. No open world. Are you guys sure about this? Mm -mm 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 -mm. All right, guys, I'm gonna roll this out. I'm gonna roll this shit out. Open world racing game. Yeah, you can drive everywhere you want. Wasn't there a game that was that? The, uh, project cars. No, no, fuck. No, there was a game that you allowed you to like, just casually race with other people online. It was kind of fun. What was it called? Like, there was some d game demo on on the 360 too. Just allowed you like race on an island, and just have fun, and just not do anything. Not the crew. Not the crew. This was like 2008, 2007. No, Drift City, holy shit. Blast from the past. Test Drive Unlimited, that's the one. That's the one. Alright, let's go. Blur, 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 blur. Look, at all, look at all the research we got. Dude. Dude. I think this is gonna take a little hit. Do you imagine if we did 2D graphics? 2D fucking tracing <laughs> simulator in this day. Alright, the hype is up. We got so much research, dude. This is great. Look at all the bugs, though. <coughs> There's a ton of fucking bugs, but, you know, that's what happens. But still. Um. Alright. No, get rid of that bug. Get rid of the bug, dude. All right, I, I'm, I'm curious. I, I really hope this is gonna be a good one. All right, 3D graphics is up a little bit. All right, here we go. I go chop your dollar. 2D graph. All right, good. We finally have it. We finally have it. All right. All right. I'm gonna- I'm gonna close my eyes, but first I'm gonna do this. If Closing my eyes. Can I open my eyes? Yes. Yeah, it's seven, seven, not bad. I am the winner. I am the winner. Uh, yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Lucky number seven. Jackpot, slot, slot, slot. Jackpot, jackpot, jackpot. Casino. Yeah, it's not too bad. It's making money though. It's making money though. Uh, let's do another large booth. We'll get the money back. It's like self, dude, we all, we always like sell a million. Maybe not this time though. We'll see. We'll see for sure. Garbage. <sighs> Seems to have no end. Yeah. Fuck me. Fuck me, dude. <laughs> so weird that we. You know what? Let's get another g guy in. How many do we have this year? That's good. That's tight. I like that. I like what I'm seeing. I like what I'm seeing! Alright, fine. That's good. 
44. All right, I'm gonna get a new new guy after this. Uh, let's do like a really good guy. One million, one million. Come on, break it, 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 break it. Uh, I don't think we can. But anyway, we got Joshua Curry, spicy guy. Uh, Leroy Robshaw, Chase Tate, and Jack Long. Uh, middle name Dick. Um, damn, this got great. Oh, dude, 500. That's great. Joshua, dude, Joshua. Chase, Chase is garbage. <laughs> Chase Tit. Chase Tit and Jack Long. Uh, Jack's pretty good, though. Um, fuck me, dude, and then I hire a new guy. Yeah. <laughs> we, should, we should get a Nigerian scammer. That's what we should get. We should uh, get, uh, uh, what, what's his name? What's his name? His name is Usufia. Usufia. By the way, if you want to know something really fucking funny, uh, you want to know something really funny about the Nigerian scammer guy? You know the song I just played? Well, guess what? Oops. I'll, 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 I'll love this, this one headline. Hmm. Oops. I go chop your dollar. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> That's fucking right. Oops. We are the winners. He is the loser. Oh. Uh, he was the loser. He's not the winner. <clears throat> anyway, who are we getting, guys? Let's see here. Kind of want to get a lot of technology, or I guess design. Some of the good design. Let's see design. Chase has got design, but his speed sucks ass. Guys, between Chase and Tate, who are we getting? Jack or Chase? I think actually it's better with with Jack. Wait a minute. Hold. Wait. 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 Guys, uh, <clears throat> it's decided. It's decided. Let the dead in the master appear. For one land is just a game. For one nine is just a game. Oh, one million, one million, one million, one million! You can do it! You can do it! Come on, one million, goddammit! Uh, 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 one million! Yeah. We're the best, Ming. Alright, you guys go on vacations now, alright. So. Employee of Environmental Protection Agency. No! Fuck off. I'm trying to ruin the goddamn atmosphere with my shitty games, not save it. Jesus Christ, dude. I want you to research. 3D graphics, V2, super fucking important. And I will do a game report on ferret racing. And you're going on vacation. And you're going on vacation. What else should we do? A new topic? Fantasy? Fantasy? Dude, how the fuck did they do fantasy before? God damn. Micronoff is not their own tablet device to combat the massive market share of a grapple... The M-pad. Features a sophisticated cover that comes that comes with this integrated ultra-thin keyboard. This is widescreen. What does this have to do with games? Well, that's really what they should be asking themselves when they're doing mobile games, but... Yep. 
Whatevs. Now we can literally have Final Fantasy. Isn't there like a cross genre thing we can research soon? Yeah, that's good. That's goody good. How about soundtrack? <laughs> Achievements. Chivos! We gotta have Chivos, dude. New action, alright. What else are we gonna have? We gotta have, uh... Uh... Better AI. And we also gotta get, um... Easter eggs. We gotta, we gotta juice this one up. And then I, got, I want, um... Day and night cycle. <laughs> Looking at our past multi-platform games, it becomes clear that we should be able to drastically reduce the cost of developing a single game for multiple platforms. We could better optimize our game engines for multi-platform development. Multi-platform. Oh, dude, that just that just hit. Oh, fuck. Now, my how, how much is that? That is a hundred. Fuck! I should have saved up for that. Well, with the next game we'll release, it'll be gravy. It'll be fucking gravy. Don't worry about it. Alright guys, new engine. New engine right away. Oh dude, now we're releasing- now we're really close to like now time. Inventors released their bid in the next generation of consoles will be the- the woo With integrated display. This is make- it much be interesting to be given each player a unique screen. Surfing is also going to be a brave move. Next year. Yeah. Anyway, uh, you know what we should do? We should look for some publishing deals. We haven't done that. Any topic casual for the grapple, dude. Uh, this would be... Let's sell out. Let's sell out. Let's fucking sell out. Let's make this shit. Let's make, like, Flappy Birds. Fuck yeah. Yeah, for sure. And it's also gonna be available on the, the, the phone. And... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh my god, this is gonna be a disaster, but I have so much money, I don't care. Uh... And GS. Can I just pick two? GR phone doesn't support- okay, well fine then. We're just gonna go for the pad. It's gonna be called, uh... Fappy Birds. Nah, just kidding, I'm not that on original. I'm gonna call it, uh... Um... Uh, Fap Falcon. Uh... Oh! Uh... 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 What are we calling it? I don't know. Anyway, pick topic. I'm gonna do... I'm gonna do a... A virtual pet game. A virtual pet casual. No, what... A, a rhythm casual. Uh... Fashion. Oh, yeah. Now we're talking. Game them, how meta. We should make it small, that's what we should do. Uh, virtual pet, no. I guess music. Music... Simulation, let's... <laughs> Dwayne! Oh, Dami, what the hell? Dwayne! Oh, yes. For sure, dude. This will be the last on the ferret engine. Diame! Alright, uh... I'm gonna go with 2D graphics on, on this one, because it's just, it's just, you know, it's bullshit. It's phone game, dude. Diame! Alright, uh... <laughs> the advanced cutscenes! <laughs> like an HD cutscene from YouTube with, with, you know... You know, inspiration, Dwayne. Uh, magazines. Uh, you just look at what other kids are at school are wearing. Dwayne! Janet! Jenna! Uh, gameplay, story quest. Fuck that. Yeah, gameplay's gotta be... Like, something like that. Casual simulation. Alright, yeah. Jammin! Yeah, I want some story on Dwayne. Actually, I'd like some story on Dwayne. Where did he come from? Where did he go? Where did he come from? Dwayne Boy Joe. 
Hi, this is Curtin Gillen from Gamers. I got word. Yeah, it's gonna be a hype game, you know what. Your new game is a musical. More on sound. More on sound. Thanks for your time. Branching story and advanced cutscenes. Uh, it's a particularly important of a game that is seems to uh, agree on this. Yeah, I know. I know. I know what I'm doing, dude. Fuck. There's a lot of hype for this. Uh, no dialogue. Uh, what the fuck now? Casual simulation. But level design. I don't know. Uh, I don't know, guys. <laughs> Gotta be honest. Uh, Dwayne! Come on, Dwayne. Alright. How the hell do we do this casual simulation music? Uh... I don't know, what, what do you guys think? I only have one looping song, well I know what the song I'm gonna pick. All in AI, AI alright. <laughs> Better dialogues. You need that AI dancing. Level the sign over AI. Really? You sure? Alright, level the sign max, max diet. No, I'm not gonna do dialogue. Uh, uh, I don't know. I actually don't know. Lots of level design and dialogue. No. AI and dialogue. No design. Okay, you guys are fucking pulling my leg now. I think I'm gonna go with this. I'm gonna go with like a mix like this. And if we, hey, hey, if we fuck up, I'm gonna learn from my mistakes. Hey, it's not like it's gonna be the end of the world if I release a bad. We have a streak of good games. A streak of good games. Like one bad shit game will not matter. But there's a lot of fucking hype for this. A lot of hype. Sound. Gotta have sound. Dude, Jack, Jack, dude, Jack, 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 my man. Alright, graphics. Let's just do this. World of Sun doesn't really matter that much, I, I guess, in a, in a fucking casual simulation game. So, uh, graphics. Strobe lights. Can I hire shells? I wish I could. I actually said that. I, I would love if I could be a, a corporate shithead in this and, and literally like shell out my crap to magazines and be like, you know, slip them a few bucks under the table and be like, yeah, my game is good, you know that? And they're like, yeah, it sure is. I love that. Seriously, it sounds fucked up, but I love that that rancid corruption that you can do in some games. Like, I, I love that shit. Uh, get Steerus on. It is Steerus on, dude. Uh, graphics. I'm gonna go with this, because sound's gotta be prioritized over everything else. Mixed reviews at launch, with many of them highlighting the fact that the M-pad is indeed not the same as the grapple from... the GR-pad from grapple. We need to see the future of the Oh my god. What the fuck? Jesus Christ. A lot of people really want to play this one, huh? If this fucker actually gets released and it's good, then uh, we have a dilemma. Like, you have a d dilemma in, in, in the sense that, uh, you know, oh, so much hype for Dwayne. All right, guys, here we go. Yeah, yeah, forever. Sip Meyer, okay. Mini games. Oh, that's cool. Okay, the, the, the Woo has been released. Alright guys, here we go. I haven't opened my eyes. Yeah! <laughs> I keep releasing garbage, but it's... it's... Fuck. Played it for days, I bet you did, you fucking asshole. Yeah, man. 
Oh, this is gonna be a fucking Armageddon of, of sales now. Oh my god, look at how much it's selling! Holy fuck! Oh my god, look at how much it's selling, dude! Oh my god! Oh, dude, what the fuck? Oh, dude, look at that. Look at that. Four million. Four fucking million! Six million. Dwayne. Holy shit. Oh, my fucking god. Janet! Oh, dude. God damn, son. 37. I'm becoming a juggernaut. Kosoge Games, dude. The best in the business. Seven fucking million? Oh my god. Selling out feels great. <laughs> now I can... I have so much money, I can like... I can eat money. I, that doesn't even make sense. Almost fucking 10 million? Are you serious? Holy shit, dude. What the fuck? Can I really push it to, like, 10 fucking million? Oh god, here we go. 10 million! 10 million! Oh, yeah! 10 fucking million, dude! 10 million is fucking... Holy shit, I can't even... Fuck me. Yeah, I know it's published with a publisher, but still, that's just... That's just crazy. And power of the Dwayne. God damn. God, I can't even believe that much. Jesus Christ. You can literally a, do a dollar bill salad, yeah? <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, that's a lot of fucking money, huh? Uh, but now that we've done that, we can do a game report on this, see what was good. And you can... You can, uh, research multi-platform optimized, uh, for sure. And after that's done, you can research, uh... Uh... Minigames. Or rich backstory, fuck it. Or a new topic, fuck it. Uh... Pirate, no, yeah. How ironic. Uh... <laughs> let's do mono sound, oh yeah. Now we're gonna do rich backstory. Strong audience, young. Let's make, let's make baby crap. Let's make baby crap. Alright. Th th this stream has been really successful. Like, I can't believe how much fucking money we've got. Like, it it's kind of nuts. Dwayne, uh, World of Science to be very uh, great. Alright, cool. Jack Long is still new to the team. A few more games to the idea. Guys, I think it's a time for a new engine. This is gonna be called. Uh, can I just ditch the old graphics? Like, why do I need different, like. What is the benefit of having both 3D graphics V1 and V2? Like, what's... Uh, how about this? The... The... The Dwayne-gen. <laughs> Dwayne-gen. Alright. Shouldn't even be a need for, like, V1, right? Ditch, they will ditch it. Yeah, fuck it. I don't... I don't need it. Better AI, Easter eggs, stay in night cycle, all right. The life cycle. All right. Ditch Jerry, yeah. Dwayne Jin. Here we go. It's gonna be the best one ever. Oh, man. <clears throat> you can still use them in the end. Yeah, but... Eh. 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 Forget about 2D. Fuck it. But how do you make iPhone games in 3D? Uh... Well... That's how it is. Uh... Boss of Wildlife Station Internal Coding Contest. I think we could all learn a lot by this. As an incentive, we should need a prize winner for the winner. Yeah, alright. Yeah, sure. Let's do that. Who can code the best? Who's the best coder? <laughs> code how to click a button with your mouse. 
amazing. And I had the chips on my on my desk here that I randomly picked up. All right, Chivosu. All right, yo, five in the new game engine. That's right. One million engine, yeah. You know it. Dwayne Jin. <laughs> After this, they're all going on vacation, though, before we release the new game. We should see what the, any publishers want, and then we can see what, what happens. Uh, it's a large booth every year. The next game, we should just do a juggernaut. Yeah, like a total juggernaut. Alright. You go on vacation, you go on vacation. Uh, uh, what else? Dwayne! See how many people. I don't think there's gonna be a lot of people this year. I actually might eat those words up. Yep. Holy fuck. 34, we're actually, uh, damn son won the contest. This is lucky to distribute the price of 90,000 90, to charity. Yep. Fuck them. Alright. Super trash, brothers. Trash. Alright. I should publish more games myself. Yeah, maybe, but. Um, I mean, if they're really, really, really good, I'm gonna release a big one. A big old steamer. Out of nowhere, a new game company called Kickin' has kicked up a media store with sexually crap punning and developing a new. Oh, you know. Oh, no. Oh, fuck. Oh, dude. The Ooh, yeah. So it's a similar technology modern. Oh, my God. You know what? You know what? I gotta go pretty soon. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go out. I'm gonna do a joke. I'm gonna do a joke ending to this. Um, I'm gonna continue game dev tycoon, but I gotta go for the night. So I'm gonna do instead. I'm gonna release total garbage. And, uh... We'll get something good out of it. Like, uh, we'll just make the worst thing. You just gotta wait for it. Oh my god. This save now. Damn, son, sequel, yeah. Alright, release this fucking thing already. Yeah, I don't- I didn't play Autolos, I didn't get time to do it. I noticed it's fucking midnight, so... Yeah. Grab my oldest engine, yeah. <laughs> this is like some monstrosity fucking on, on the Ouya. Oh my god. <clears throat> uh, let's see here. Uh, boss, a small number of dedicated fans have asked that we release the source code to one of our older games and run some coal. Doing so would surely satisfy these fans, but given that we worked hard on the engine, we could also sell a license for it and make them money. We could simpler refuse their... What should we do? Should we give it away or sell it? It runs on coal, baby. How about you just give it away so we get more fans? Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Screw it. I'm gonna be nice. It's old. It's fucking old, dude. Our recent decision to give away our engine rolls and coal was met with positive response from fans of Rubble Gained, and it cost us. Yeah, this is fucking nothing. Come on. Give it away. <laughs> the coating's just a sack of coal. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Release the wheel already, goddamn. Come on. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna make trash, trash. All right, I, I have to ask. Um, how bad is the Ouya? Like, how bad is the fuck up? Is the fuck up and failure of it catastrophically bad, or is it just like a, a bad console, or is it just like a fucking Titanic of a console? I gotta say, like, from what I've heard, it's real bad. Like. Jesus Christ, how bad. Release it. Release it. I guess we can research something in the meantime. Uh, 
know what we should do? We should do this. New topic, just get a hunting, and then it's just a trash topic and just get something good instead. It's so bad, it's horrible. Ugh. Ugh. Let's see what else we have in the topic. We have surgery. Surgery? Surgeon Sim? Holy fuck. Let's do that. Let's just make a bunch of jokes. Let's research mono sound. Mmm. You can do contract work in the meantime, I guess. I, I guess I gotta do this. Contract work. Uh, logo animation. Yeah, you just do that in the meantime. Fuck it. Sorgery. Cool. Dr. Pepper makes his return. And I'm just kind of making joke choices until uh, the Ouya gets released here. What else do we have on the topic? We have vocabulary. What the fuck? Alright. No. It's a $99 console. Is the Ouya like... Wait a minute. Just as industry seems to have silently accepted the slow demise of PC gaming as more and more games are primarily made for consoles, it seems to be a resurgence of the PC market. What? Okay. <laughs> Now, new powerful and affordable hardware growing indie developer scene and the real estate crowdfunded and financial news do. It seems that the PC market will only grow strong in the coming years. For console lovers, this isn't bad news either, as many PC games are also ported to the most successful consoles. Welcome to now! RC Glow. <laughs> Wonder if anyone gets that reference. We're gonna make it glow. How are we gonna make the RC Cola glow? Well, that's not for me to figure out. What I am selling you is RC Glow. Alright. 27, holy shit. Alright, Ooh, yeah, it has been released, guys. I'm gonna do a save, and then we just totally hit the shitter. Oh my god, this is gonna be the worst. Alright, here we go. <laughs> New game. It's gonna be called, uh, uh, Strobe Lights and, uh, White Noise. It's gonna be a large game, and it's gonna be a, a, uh, a, uh, a history game, a life game, because you have seizures with it. Uh, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a Action uh, RPG. <laughs> no, it's a, it's a casual simulation. That's right. It's gonna be on the uh, Ouya, of course. Oh, that's brittle cheap. Dwayne and uh, for mature audiences. No, for young people, for babies, so that young babies can, you know. Oh my god, I'm going to hell. Here we go. Uh, 3D graphics. If this actually makes money, I'm gonna eat uh, my non-existent. Hat. Uh, maximum story quests. Uh, no engine gameplay. Uh, yeah, let's just do something like that. I don't know. I, I don't give a fuck at this point. <sighs> if this actually makes money, dude. Baby seizures. Yeah, they kind of grim and morbid. Yes, it's gonna be a hype game. You know it. Good God. Uh, yeah, better AI and Easter eggs. Easter eggs, like, sometimes the, the lights flash a little faster if you scream. Uh, whatever, dude. Whatever, I don't, I don't care. Look at the hype. You, you know, you know what? Marketing. Massive campaign. You know what? What can I do here? Can I do campaign on campaign on campaign? Like, can I do another campaign? I got enough saved, so don't worry. Let's just keep doing this. I don't think it works like that, so I, I think it's just like pissing away money, but whatever. <laughs> uh, whatever. Rich backstory and, you know, everything. It's gotta have everything, dude. On the fucking Ouya. Oh my god. 
It's almost up to 300. It's gonna reach 300! 300 hype! Ah! Ah! What the fuck? Oh my fucking god. It has so much fucking advertising. No, fuck off. Fuck off. Alright. Alright. Let's see what happens. Strobe lights and white noise. Alright, let's release this fucking shit. Mod support, full motion video, now? Okay, save to cloud, okay. Which is a flawed crap. Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. You know what? You know what? It's a scam anyway, so... Uh... Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. If anybody follow me, my brother, I go jump up. National efforts, Nani get up. National stadium, Nani build up. Does this actually sell us well? I want to die. Alright, well, that, that's how it goes. Strobe lights and I, I saved the Ouya. Holy fuck, dude. What the hell? What the fuck? You are the loser. I am the winner. Yep. Yep. Alright, guys, I'll be right back to the tight end. Uh, yeah, I'll show what they are, so I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Anyway, um, I'm not quite sure, but I think I showed this last time. I don't know, but um, yeah, with my shitty memories. But um, from Robot Trigger, here is Metaton, or me as Metaton. Yeah. Uh, very cool. Total Nagia. Here's me uh, having a post op with Metaton. <laughs> of course. Very, very cool. Very, very cool. From Light Dasher. It was I, providers. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice. Here from Ben has drowned. Uh, did you did you know that Ben was in a coma? Um, did you know? Um, here's me and Vinny. Uh, very cool. Uh, very nice. I like the uh, the colors and all that. Very cool, dude. Thank you. From uh, Sir Silver. Oh. 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 That whore! That whore! Etc. Uh, but that's what happens sometimes. You can't sometimes fuck the fish. That's what happens. But, uh... Oh, God. Uh, from uh, Dave FTW. Ooh. Shit games, shit AAA games, VHS animes, Bubble Black, Bone Metal, My Love, Hit List, 1001 Ways to Destroy Pineapple Pizza Barbecue Quest 2 and Candy Kong Rule 34. What the fuck? <coughs> what the fuck is wrong with me? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's great. From XDBX. It's a little Halloween uh, pumpkin um, thingy. Uh, very cool. Fortunately, we don't have too many of these in Sweden. You know, we don't have the whole like pumpkin thing, but uh, I like it. This is really cool. I uh, you should uh, you should post a a thing with with it lighted lighted as well, so you can see how it's like illuminating stuff. But very cool, dude. Thank you. Very cool. Very cool. Trino San, I want to stay with you. I have places to go. <laughs> oh, that's great. I love this art style you got going on. Very cool. Thank you. From B Fox, is Azrael. Very cool. Very very cool. 
uh, from uh, Joel Fangirl. Bad ending. Hi, Joel! Can you please, please, please play Silent Hill 4 if you finish Silent Hill 1? Uh, probably. Probably. Uh, can't say for sure, though, but... Uh, um, yeah, I've got to upload fucking Silent Hill 1, the ending, to YouTube first. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll see for sure. We'll, we'll see, you know. Uh, just because October is going to end in, in you know, two weeks doesn't mean that we can't stop playing Silent Hill. But, um, yeah, for sure. From White Man Dio... Happy, happy Christmas. Christmas coming, guys. <laughs> Not happy Halloween. December ween. Part 5 as shit. It's not shit, but it's not as good as the other ones. There I said it. Very cool. From White Man Dio. Uh, read from t f right to left. This is my girlfriend, Undyne. Starting today, I am Alpha's girlfriend. Pleased to meet you. Oh, man. Story of my life, everybody. <clears throat> anyway, from Clarison Doodles. Thank you, Joel. Here's me and good old Azriel. Uh, very cool. Very, very cool. I like the art style a lot. Very cool. Thank you. From Mega Nine Man. Spaghetti is the best food. <laughs> of course it is. Of course it is. Very cool. A lot of, a lot of Undertale art, but I am kind of missed art because I've been sick, but still. For Snail Queen. There's a bunch of Undertale stuff. <laughs> Here's Snaps the Block, the Snails, Pyres, Goat Mom Pie, Sands, Flowies. Very cool. Very, very cool. I like that a lot. Metal Band, of course. The Metal Band. My my favorite. From Night Freak. Uh, Should've fucked that fish when you had the chance. Yeah, punk. Oh, Lord. Now we're talking. Now we're back in business, as they say. Hubba bubba, you know, I go sushi on that. Man, oh man, salmon in my puss. Hey, <laughs> very nice though, thank you. Uh, from Clarison Doodles. You're gonna have a bad time, Joel. I bet I am, because genocide run on Friday. That's right, Friday is officially the day where I go around and kill everybody. Uh, but very cool, thank you. Dears, here is me with a Undertale Earthbound combination. It's very cool. It's sort of like a Nesfrisk. Furnace. <laughs> PK Fire. Oh, that's awesome. That's very cool. Thank you. From uh, Tibet Toucan. Here's a little tutorial. Very, very cool. I like the art style. From uh, Elena D. Here is Vinny dreaming up all the streamers. He was all in his head. He was dead all along. <laughs> is Vinny in a coma? Game theory. F no, wait, game theory isn't even like that. It's more like it's more like bold statements, and then it's like when people start to be like, "You, you sound like a fucking crackhead," and he's just like, "But it's just the game theory," you know, you know. <laughs> but uh, very cool, very very cool. From Tr Trino San has a very cool shadow of the skull, Ma shadow of Skull Mountain uh, fan art. And I actually, I actually uh, had the guy who did co-develop it with me uh, check it out uh, that I streamed it, and he, he he wanted to give you guys the utmost thanks uh, for for your kind comments and and that you gave a shit about about our game together. So he sends he sends his his loves and kisses and and warm thanks to you all for uh, doing art for Skull Mountain and uh, checking it out and all that. But uh, yeah. Um, I didn't expect uh, so much stuff for Shadow of Skull Mountain, but I'm glad you guys liked it. But this co this art is really cool. Thank you. From uh, Greethy B, here's a little Sans. Crying, mind you. Uh, very cool. It's crazy eye. <laughs> very nice. For cucumbers, cu cucumbers, cucumbers. Here's Sans, uh, the Vork Skeletor Sans. Sans Skeletor, yes. But uh, very cool. The Blighted One. Earthbound will be uh, coming back. Pokey, boil some water for life noodles. Jules coming back. <laughs> All right. Uh, here, here's here the uh, very very interesting interpretation of, of, of Guy Guess, but uh, yeah. I don't like him when they draw him in that like weird 
Earthbound one, uh, this Earthbound one, but Mother one style. It just doesn't look like him at all. But uh, this is very cool. Thank you. From Mega Noah, here's Vorks Yellowthor, because that's what I'm gonna call him for now. Because that, that's him, spooking around, getting the Halloween candy. <laughs> What's that in the background? Hang on. That is, is that a Temi? <laughs> very cool. From Weirdness Unfolds, another Vorks Yellowthor. Very cool, little pixel art for you. Speaking about pixel art, from Fluffy Zergling, pixel art after the other. Here's also another one. Very tight. Very cool. The Kitty Hawk. Almost said the Titty Hawk. I'm sorry. Uh, but uh, Joel will be right back. Very cool. Very, very cool. Thank you. And from Acidica Juju. 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 Acidica Juju. Um. Here's some really cool art inspired by Riddick. Riddick art, which actually, um, Riddick art, um, if you don't know, if you're not familiar with him, he is a, a album uh, cover artist, or he does art. And he does some really, really tasty art. Uh, if you're a fan of, like, uh, satanic gore, as I call it, then you're probably like this. Uh, and this guy is also making the cover art to my uh, next album. That I'm gonna release. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna look, have something that I can proudly say, yeah, that's my album. They're gonna be like, oh shit, that looks like, you know, real good. And I'm gonna be like, yeah, you know. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, take a look at this. Fucking tight, huh? Regardless, uh, very, very cool piece from uh, Acidica here. Uh, guts hanging, dude. Guts hanging. Uh, very cool. Very, very cool. Uh, from Reply Mail, here's uh, Shadow Skull Mountain. <laughs> it's the actual Skull Mountain, which I never had in the game, but, you know, the, the art you guys drew, drew uh, before and now is just, like, canon to the game, since it's not done, but... Uh, very cool. For Veniglotti, better refused. Anim anime speed lines. Whoosh, you know. Tight. From Reply Mail, uh, here's the Sans. Looking more realistic than I... Expected him, but uh, very cool, very very cool. Lena D, here's another Sans. <laughs> Tight. From Zafiel, here's another Sans. A lot of Sans art, but uh, very very cool, very very cool. I didn't. Uh, yeah, he does wear slippers, huh? Uh, from Trash Man, there's a comic he made. How could my wife leave me for a skeleton? Simple. I don't get it. <laughs> oh my god, that's great. I love that face on Sans. That's a really good comic. Thank you. Awesome. From Snitchin. Hang on, this is, this, is a, this is a gif. Hey, Joel, you've been safe scumming. Looks like the termination is coming in handy. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna like, we do a weird safe scum. And when I do it on Friday, I'm gonna use my laptop. I'm gonna use my laptop to stream Undertale, because if I do a genocide run after this save, I'm gonna feel like a dick. Because, like, the game is ref referencing that if you delete your save file, all the progress and all the characters, what, what happened to them, will be erased. And I don't want that. And if you do a genocide run, it permanently fucks your game. Like, it changes the, out the outcome every time, or whatever. So I'm gonna do it on my laptop, so I have two separate files. You can't have two separate files in, in Undertale, so, yeah. Smart, huh? Smart. Uh, but yeah, from New Vajolkheim, 419, the game, I am the winner, you are the loser. Nice game, I mean, nice game, I mean, game, yeah, IGN 10 out of 10. <laughs> very nice, very nice. From Jumero 2 do 2 here is, here is Ferret Racing, the best game, I play the shit out of that, you know it, you know it, that's awesome, that's awesome, dude. Speaking about awesome, from the Scarlet Devil, here's a little Undyne. And, uh, you know, I ain't gotta say it. You know what I'm gonna say, and I'm gonna do a... You know, you know, I don't need to fill in the blanks, alright? But, regardless, uh, that is some very cool art. I love the art style here. I love the, uh, the shadow, uh, the, the shading, sorry, and, and lighting and stuff like that. Very, very cool. Very, very cool. And from, uh... At RDNX, here is Napa Block. Clever. 
All right, clever, goddamn it. All right, guys. Uh, I will see you guys next time tomorrow. Sorry, I didn't do autoless tonight, but uh, I've been feeling kind of sick, so yeah. Anyway, guys, uh, I'm gonna see who's live right now. Who is live on Vine Sauce? Uh, Limes. So I'm gonna go host Limes. All right, guys. Take care. Stay safe, and uh, yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. See ya.